विभिन्न घर तरफ हेलो हाय हाय एवरीबॉडी हेलो एम आई ऑडिबल या आई एम ऑडिबल हेलो या हाय हाय सॉरी 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 सो या आई एम बैक एंड वी विल हैव आर मिक्स्ड इमेज बेस्ड सेशन प्लस विल डू अ बिट ऑफ ऑफ था अ बिट ऑफ एग्जाम फीवर चढ़ गया क्यों अभी तो कुछ ही दिन बचे हुए हैं तो यू शुड नॉट बी स्केड राइट ऑलवेज लेट यार लड़की हूँ ठीक है लड़की हूँ आई एम रियली सॉरी एक्चुअली यहाँ पे डिवाइस नहीं है लास्ट मिनट है ना एवरीबडी इज बिजी आई एम अलोन यूर सो इशू हो गया उस वजह से ओ uh, बी का कब सेशन होगा अभी क्या कराऊ मैं <laughs> ठीक है स्ट्रेस बहुत है इट्स फाइन मेरी खूबसूरती देख लो स्ट्रेस चला जाएगा नो एनीवे यू शुड नॉट बी स्ट्रेस्ड एट दिस पॉइंट राइट ओके टुडे विद सब्जेक्ट्स इमेजेस लेट्स सी ओबीजी सेशन हो गया भाई हाँ इट वाज टेकन बाय अ फैकल्टी राइट हरमीत मैम ने लिया था स्टार्ट कर दू मैं लेट्स स्टार्ट कुछ भी करो यूजफुल होगा मेनी क्वेश्चन विल कम फ्रॉम दिस डोंट वरी आई हैव मेड श्योर टू एड ऑल द ऑल द थिंग्स टुमारो लेट्स सी टुमारो सर विल डू तो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन व्हाट इज द मोस्ट कॉमन कॉज ऑफ चाइल्डहुड ब्लाइंडनेस व्हाट इज द मोस्ट कॉमन कॉज ऑफ चाइल्डहुड ब्लाइंडनेस एंड दैट इज योर दैट इज योर ऑफकोर्स यू नो दिस यू नो दिस Yes, yes. It is vitamin A deficiency. So your vitamin A, your vitamins, all your vitamins. Very, very, very important topic. Because hello. Yes, sir. Aja. Today I will also sit. I'll keep coming and going. Who can I? I put what I can. Here, what are you saying, sir? This is the system. So yeah, this is your vitamin A deficiency, sir. Do you want to say something? चलो सो टूडे वी आर डूइंग ऑप्था ओके एंड ऑप्था में पंद्रह क्वेश्चन है तो आई थिंक यू कैन कवर फिफ्टीन क्वेश्चन इन द नेक्स्ट यस समाइम एंड इट विल बी वेरी 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 इंपॉर्टेंट ठीक है ठीक है सो इट इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सो प्लीज गिव योर फुल अटेंशन या शैतान कौन बोला लास्ट टू थ्री डे जस्ट डू क्वेश्चन एंड चेक बिकॉज मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक वुड बी रिपीटेड एन नंबर ऑफ टाइम सो क्या करना है बार बार उनको क्या करना है आपको रिवाइज 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 करना है तो क्या करना है उसको बार बार रिवाइज करना है सो दैट दिस टॉपिक्स आर कवर्ड एम्पली एंड प्रॉपरली ठीक है तो प्लीज माई रिक्वेस्ट इज डू एंड ऑल्सो दर इज अ लिस्ट ऑफ मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक एंड पॉइंट उन पर नजर मार लो जस्ट हैव अ लुक एंड विल टेक अ सेशन फॉर सॉल्विंग द क्वेश्चन सून एंड आई थिंक विल टेक ऑन थर्ड और टू सेकेंड विल टेक विल मेडिसिन विल बी फर्स्ट ओके मेडिसिन आई टेक अ फर्स्ट सॉल्विंग क्वेश्चन या विल टेक अ सेशन सेकेंड हाउ टू अप्रोच द एग्जाम अच्छे नहीं है 
क्यों क्योंकि रिटेन तो होनी नहीं कितना ही पढ़ लो बेटर गो फॉर क्लिनिकल सब्जेक्ट एंड रिवाइज देम एज मच एज पॉसिबल थर्ड को बिजी तो सेकंड को बता दूंगा हाँ, हम... मेडिसिन विल डू ऑन फर्स्ट फर्स्ट मेडिसिन ऑन फर्स्ट सेवन पी एम ओके सेवन पी एम टूमोर मार्च एंडिंग विल डू सेकेंड ओके इमेजेस विल बी अ पार्ट देखो अलग से बच्चा टाइम कितना करा है आपको जो चेंडिंग में करा रहे वो तो इमेजेस ही हैं तो ये अजीब सा क्वेश्चन है अलग से इमेज कैसे आ जाएगी व्हेन वी आर टीचिंग निमोनिया डू वी शो इमेज ऑफ निमोनिया यस व्हेन वी आर शोइंग लेट्स से एनीथिंग इन द रेडियोलॉजी वो तो पूरा इमेजेस ही है तो अलग से इमेजेस का कोई सेंस नहीं बनता बिकॉज़ टाइम का शॉर्टेज है ठीक है तो विल डू दिस ओके चलो सो आई विल जस्ट एक्सप्लेनिंग द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन या या तो व्हाट इज द मोस्ट कॉमन कॉज वी हैव ऑलरेडी डन दिस दिस इज विटामिन तो विटामिन तो बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक लास्ट टाइम कितने क्वेश्चंस आए देयर वर फाइव क्वेश्चंस लास्ट टाइम थ्री ऑन विटामिन बी12 यस यस एंड वन ऑन विटामिन सी एंड वन ऑन डी ओके सो योर विटामिंस यू कैन नॉट यू हैव टू डू दिस यस वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ओके तो वन क्वेश्चन दैट वाज आस्क्ड प्रीवियसली वाज दिस आल्सो योर एक्स वन बी ओके दैट इज बिटॉट स्पॉट Can you see the image? So I'm doing images with with this. ठीक है? So this is your bitot spot. It is. It is. Bus arrangement. ठीक है? All these queries will reply. Bus arrangement etc. Kindly number दे देते हैं. You reply there. Okay. Okay. Please just focus only on the class here. Okay. Yeah. चलो. ठीक है? All right. We'll discuss it later. हाँ. So. What is your most common cause of visual impairment? I've I've written it down here. It is refractive error. Most common preventable infectious that is trachoma. That is right. And what is the strategy for it? ये हमने P S M में किया था right? Safe strategy right? So surgery, antibiotics, facial hygiene, and environmental improvement. That is your safe strategy. Very good. Very good. So, what is the second question here? A 39-year-old male meat transporter presented with a pustule on his hand, later, which later progressed to an ulcer. Which is the best team used to know the cause of this ulcer? Can you answer? Thank you, Doctor Rockstars. Yeah. So, this is basically you can see that. This is a pustule, and we get pustule which, especially with the male meat transporter, okay, that we see in bacillus anthracis, and the polypeptide of bacillus anthracis, it is stained by Loeffler's methylene blue. So, is me kya kya yad rakhna hai? Your McFadden's reaction again. It is a PYQ. It stains the polypeptide yes. capsule, right? Yes. Uske baad, what happens in this? You have the Hyde Porter's disease or Wool sorter's disease, right? It has a it has a tripartite toxin. Yes. What are the images that come from it? Bamboo stick appearance. What else? Pearl of string appearance. Your inverted fig tree appearance, and it is also a bioterrorist category A, right? Yeah, very good. Type A terrorism agent. Very good, very good, very yes. good. So these are the images which are very important for your bacillus anthracis. Yes. ठीक है नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन अगेन अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन विच हेज बीन आस्ट अगेन एंड अगेन तो अ पेशेंट प्रेजेंट With complaints of watery diarrhea, stomach pain since he consumed meat for lunch. Yes. The physician sent him for sample testing to confirm the organism. The microbiologist reported that the organism is capsulated, non-motile, and has a subterminal arrangement. So, ye I think you already know subterminal arrangement. We can see in very good, very good Clostridium perfringens. All right. So this is. Clostridium perfringens causes cold and meat warm yes. enterogastritis. Okay, so what medium do we use? We use Robertson cooked meat media. And what else does it cause? Look at the image. It causes gas gangrene. Okay, it causes gas gangrene. 
गैस गैंग्रीन वेरी गुड वेरी गुड वेरी गुड तो दीज आर द इमेजेस एंड द इम्पोर्टेंट पॉइंट अबाउट क्लोस्टेडियम टेटनस वेरी गुड नाउ लुक एट दिस नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन अ थर्टी ईयर ओल्ड मेल पेशेंट हैड अ कंप्लेन ऑफ अ पेनलेस टेस्टिकुलर मास्क his blood sample revealed non elevated alpha fetal protein levels so what is the answer this actually is the line which is the most important line theek hai most important line hai yahi hai if you know this that's enough so non elevated alpha fetal proteins normal alpha fetal protein that is seen in your classical seminoma so aapko kya kya yaad rakhna padta Hey, you have to remember seminometers and non-seminometers. So non-seminometers, we have yolk sac, embryonal carcinoma, and corneal carcinoma. Where your AFP levels never increase, remember it is your seminoma. Where do they increase? They increase in yolk sac tumor, which is a non-seminometers tumor. And corneal carcinoma, yaad rakhna, elder li me hota hai. And this question came. सर so, ये आया था ना पिछले दिसंबर में यस पल्मोनरी मेटास्टेसिस सो व्हिच डिसीज कैन कॉज इट इट इज कोरियो कार्सिनोमा स्मॉल सेल कार्सिनोमा दिस केम इज कैनन बॉल अपीयरेंस दीवार पे गोले पड़ते हैं तो ऐसे ही छेद आते हैं कैनन बॉल अपीयरेंस यस सो सी वी आर डिस्कसिंग इमेजेस हमने बोला था ना वी विल डू इमेजेस विद यू एंड दिस हैड कम बिफोर ओके दिस हैड कम बिफोर वेरी गुड वेरी गुड लेट्स गो टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन Do you have to read the question in this? I think image काफी है इसमें. Yes. ये इस बार repeat है. Need PG question भी है. हाँ. There's a need PG question also, guys. ठीक है. Need. It repeated in need. So, can you tell me what this is? So many people are giving <laughs> different answers. So yeah, uh, I will read the question because I'm getting different answers. A 65-year-old man, past history is permanent for mild. What is he having? Blood tests except for hematocrit. And look at this. Can you see this appearance? What is this appearance? Yes. So what is the answer? Look at the appearances very well. This is your colon cancer. If you can see closely. This has a apple core appearance. Look at it, apple core appearance. ठीक है? Apple core appearance. Always look at what they are pointing. ठीक है? बहुत important है. You have to see where they are pointing. They are pointing towards the. They are pointing towards it, right? So this is your colon cancer. Now tell me what? Which one is this? Which one is this? Sir, ये ये कौन सा है? वाह, यही तो इस बार आया था. बताओ भाई. This is your, this is your interception. ठीक है, claw hand. Can you see? बाज का पंजा. ठीक है, this is yeah very good interception. What about this one? Can you see? This is a string. It is actually a string. Can you see? There are distal dilations plus a string due to strictures. This is your string of Cantor. ठीक है, string of Cantor. This is seen in Crohn's disease. ठीक है, it is seen in Crohn's disease. What about this one? ये, this is your diffuse esophageal spasm. ठीक है, diffuse esophageal spasm. और ये, यहाँ पर दिख रहा है thumb, thumb print sign. Okay, thumb print sign which is seen in your ischemic. Yes, ischemic colitis. What about this one? Look at this now. Chat board delay हो रही है ला. कल भी ये problem. इधर देख ना, इधर देख ना. आये दस बजे तो पड़े. इसपे देख. ये तेरी में ना ये top chat चल रही है अभी. इसको top नहीं वो कर live कर. Live chat में क्या तब के तब आता है. Top में क्या important आता है. सही ना? हाँ ठीक है. This is your rat tail appearance. Seen in? हाँ. Tapering दिख रही है ना end में. There is tapering. So that is your rat tail appearance. This is seen in your Cancer, okay, esophagus cancer, esophageal cancer. What about this one? This is your 
word week appearance. It is seen in Ecclesia Cardia. So look at the images again. Again, claw hand. It is seen in your. It is seen in your interception. What about this one? This is your string of Cantor. It is seen in Crohn's. Very good. What about this one? This uh, diffuse esophageal spasm. It is seen. This is your. Diffuse esophageal spasm picture. This is the thumbprint sign seen in ischemic colitis. Very good. What about this one? This is your ecclesia cardia and rat tail appearance. So this this one slide very very important. I told you I'll do images. I told you I'll do images. That's why I brought it up. Now look at this next question. A 22 year old. A 22 year old. Yeah. So we are we have covered enough images related to esophagus, all right? So tell me, a 22 year old presents with hematemesis. That's what you can see. So what is it, A or B? Mostly people get confused. What usse hi? So you tell me, what is it? Yeah, okay. Yeah, this is actually a thoda easy hi question hai. 22 year old me me. Presents with the following, okay, and this is actually a tear, okay. This is actually a tear, it is known as Mallory Weiss tear. Why is it known as Mallory Weiss tear? I'll tell you. Forceful, it happens due to binge drinking. Firstly, binge drinking, it happens due to binge drinking, okay, and forceful vomiting, stretching. Cuffing and straining because of that. So this is actually a uh, this question had come ki where is the tear? Okay. So the tear is in the lesser curvature of the cardia in the gastric mucosa. Turn off. Yeah. So what about your Boerhaave's syndrome? Boerhaave's remember it is a Mackler's triad. Okay. I'm hundred percent sure. What about my voice? Cut or I voice. <clears throat> okay. So, yeah. Is the voice okay? Yeah, your macular triad. So, if a patient presents with intense pain, okay, intense pneumomediastinic pain, so that, that presentation is of a patient who has Bohr Harvey syndrome. Why? They have a triad. What triad? Macular's triad. Thoracic pain, vomiting, cervical, subcutaneous emphysema. Very, very important. So, this is the differentiating factor. Both are caused due to forceful retching. Due to forceful retching. Is the voice still breaking? Is the voice still breaking? Both are caused due to forceful retching. What is the difference? Or ye Borharvi usually it occurs in older patients. Thik hai? It occurs in older patients. Can you see this is a young male? Okay. So binge drinking. When you don't see older people go and chalo sharab leke hum bohat vyada pee lete hai. They have a lot of experience. So they don't do that. Young people do binge drinking. Right. So that's how you differentiate this. Okay. That's how you differentiate this. Macular's triad, again, it is in your Boerhaave syndrome, thoracic pain, vomiting, subcutaneous emphysema, while your Mallory V tear, it is seen in binge decay. Where is it seen? In the lesser cur curve of cardia, in the gastric mucosa. It is self-limiting, nothing is to be done. Okay? Okay, yes. And it may mix, Boerhaave mimics MI. Alright? So, it is very... Uh, also, within 24 hours, surgery should be done. Varna tapak jayega. Now, look at this. This next question, please read it. I have made sure to add as many relevant questions to your exam as possible. Because I am sure it will be a lot of Okay? So, just stick with me. Let's do it together. Okay. So, what is the answer? It is familial adenomatous polyp. Okay? This is fact. How many polyps do you have to see? It should be more than 100. Okay. And this is an APC gene defect. Know this much. This much is enough. Yes. Very good. What about this most common site of Morgagni hernia? Wherever the question is uh, like we can go fast, we'll go fast. Where I have to explain, we'll go slow. Okay. So, what is the answer? 
what is the answer for this what is the most common so lot of a b c yeah so this is actually your this is actually yeah it is right anterior okay so only two two things i want you to remember wash bogdac leg hernia it is b p l okay this is posterior lateral while your ram ram is anterior and what is it it is right anterior mogagni okay just remember this much can you not read can you not read your bpl which is bogdelic hernia it is posterior lateral while your mogagni it is right anterior all right just remember this much about the hernia because this is what they ask from this topic okay all right let's go to the next question now tell me what is this tell me what is this is the voice still breaking is the voice still breaking all right okay so this is your this is actually a keloid okay this is a keloid so i brought the images here and we have to remember this now only kya hai keloid is something that crosses the boundaries okay it will cross the boundaries anything on the sternum if they show you it is keloid the most common position of a keloid is two things firstly the sternum and second ear lobe theek hai ear lobe have you seen all these females getting a uh, what do you say wo karte hai na mujhe aadat nahi hai pehnne ki earrings okay yeah so within the margin look at this this is a hypertrophic scar ye ek wo ladka hai ya ladki hai jo dukh mein jaake kaat lete the apne aap ko to those kind of scar usually they are raised they are raised theek hai but they do not cross the boundary of where the cut had been okay they do not cross the boundary so which one crosses the boundary your keloid crosses this one does not cross the boundary theek hai the other thing was dermoid cyst so this question came in december december 2020 one okay they asked how many layers were involved in this so remember this is a benign benign the most common benign ovarian tumor okay ovarian tumor and it involves all three layer all three layers okay all three layers uh yeah i also have a hypertrophic scar jo uh bahut matlab jab pyar mein bharosa karte the tab aise bakchodiya ki thi us time pe theek hai so anyways uh so this is your hypertrophic scar this is your keloid remember the positions again it is one ear lobe and sternum this is your dermoid cyst which involves all three layers okay it involves all three layers now look at this what is this next question what is this next question what is this next question hesitant cuts kis mein hai who who will will not do suicide but you know for attention karte hain okay yeah so the answer for this is perianal abscess why can you see there is a membrane can you see that there is no discharge or anything pyloneal sinus it is a fistula right so hemorrhoids you will have bleeding prolapse kuch nikal jayega bahar so i don't see anything so this is a perianal abscess this is your pro prolapse it is seen both in young uh, children and adults so adults you need to do surgery but in children you can do it is self limiting it goes back how much would you call that it is a prolapse at least 1 to 4 cm should come up okay and the adult one is associated with third degree hemorrhoids okay it is associated with third degree hemorrhoids is the voice breaking is the voice breaking i think this is the third time i'm seeing ki voice break ho rahi hai 
so no okay so let's continue let's continue then so this is your hemorrhoid remember one to four centimeter and in adults you have to do surgery this is your pilonidal sinus one of my friends had it and then us matlab itne achhe dost bano ki jaake unki madad karo jab they had a surgery and you know they have to go to the washroom to aap lekar jao unhe to this is the fistula it will have hair inside theek hai so this is your pilonidal sinus what about this one which one is painless internal or external tell me which one is painless internal or external which one is painless internal or external your hemorrhoids which one is painless okay very good your internal one is painless and it is about the dentate line distal to the dentate line it is your it is your external hemorrhoids which is painful okay painful is your external internal is painless there are four clinical grades how do you say firstly there is no prolapse just prominent blood vessels that is grade 1 what about grade 2 it comes out on straining but it goes back by itself this one it comes out by straining but you can push it back theek hai ghusa ke andar dal sakte ho what is fourth grade it does not come out okay it does not come out these are the stages of your hemorrh hemorrhoids the grades or stages of hemorrhoids which one doesn't jo bilkul bhi it it is permanent it does not go out is your grade 4 yes stage 4 which one you can push back in that is your grade 3 your grade 2 it comes out but wo bolta hai ki main apne aap chala jata hu it's okay aap itni itni mehnat mat karna it goes by itself and this is just prominent blood vessels all right so these are your grades of hemorrhoids just go through this very very important okay very good very good good evening dr strange now look at this what is the answer for this okay for these kind of images i ha satabdi manners hai usme so for this kind of images for these kind of questions i think you just have to look at the image and you can answer last line they are asking you the treatment and the options this is how you solve such questions if a question gets longer aap kya karoge last line and the options so this is definitely bird beak appearance aplasia cardia you do a hellers cardiomyopathy very good very good you do a hellers cardiomyopathy in such a patient okay let's go to the next question now this is an important question and we will do images related to the a young female presents with dysphagia for the past 2 years acha a 27 year old woman is undergoing routine surveillance colonoscopy for ulcerative colitis so can you tell me what is the morphology of the polyps theek hai what is the morphology of the polyps so a lot of so what is the answer yeah i want you to remember whenever they are talking about ulcerative colitis the just one sec let me just connect the wifi which is here ulcerative colitis the polyps that we see in ulcerative colitis are pseudo polyps okay let's go through the images of ulcerative colitis plus your crohn's disease very 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 important okay so which one is this we already discussed this is your string of cantor it happens because of strictures theek hai can you see the string this is your string of cantor okay what is this this is creeping fact again it is seen in crohn's disease both of these are seen in crohn's disease what is this can you see that these are skip lesions this is a lesion this is normal this is again a lesion okay so these are skip lesions what about your ulcerative colitis it is it starts from the rectum and it keeps on going so another question that they ask us in this disease which is very very important both of them are inflammatory bowel diseases and they ask us which one is curative 
like cutting, resecting, which where is it curative? Because you ha get Crohn's disease, you get skip lesions, you cannot do, curate it. I mean, it cannot be, it cannot cure by just resecting the intestine. So what in UC, it is curative to resect. Okay, very good. And re rectum, where is it spared? It is spared in your Crohn's disease and it starts in ulcerative colitis. What about this one? This is your cobblestone appearance. Can you see? This is your cobblestone appearance. Very good, very good. This is your cobblestone appearance. Okay. And also remember one more one liner. Your granuloma is a hallmark of Crohn's disease. It is a hallmark of Crohn's disease. They will never give you this alone. This is actually the granuloma. But I they'll give you other images related to that. Look at ulcerative colitis images. Remember, it is retrograde. It starts from the rectum and goes upwards. Okay. The, these are your pseudo polyps. While Crohn's disease is transmural, here only mucosa and submucosa is involved. That's why the polyps on this are pseudo polyps. Look at the image again. Okay. Look at the image again. These are your pseudo polyps and it has crypt abscesses. Just remember, neutrophil hote hai. This is the crypt abscess mostly they won't ask you this but they'll ask you the image of what tox uh, they'll ask you the image of lead pipe appearance okay lead pipe appearance because of loss of hostations right so lead pipe appearance what is the drug of choice in uc what is the drug of choice in uc drug of choice we have sulfur salazine okay sulfur salazine and in Crohn's disease, we can give methotrexate. Okay, methotrexate can be given. All right, very good, very good. Let's go to the next question. Again, very, very, very important question. It is relevant to surgery, and I'm trying to do as many relevant questions before the exam as possible. Okay, big fan Putin. I think Paris hoga to Putin ka fan. I'm not. Nee, Paris bhi nahi hoga. Kyunki wo gaya tha Ukraine. Okay, so this is your, this is your, what is the disease? We are talking about pancreatitis here, okay? Pancreatitis here, what is the sign known as? Periumbilical ecchymosis. You can see it has turned because of bleeding. This is Cullen's sign, okay? This is Cullen's sign. There's another sign known as Gray Turner sign, which is seen on the flank. And the answer for this is actually D. The answer for this is D. So, amylase and lipase both increase your, in your pancreatitis. But amylase is very, amylase is non-specific. Remember this. It can be seen in other diseases also. Like it can be seen in peptic ulcer. It can be seen in mesenteric ischemia. Okay. So, it is seen in other places. But your lipase increase is very specific to acute pancreatitis. What is the investigation of choice? Again, very, very important. It is CCT. What is this sign? This is your flank pay. You get on the flank, you have this ecchymosis due to retroperitoneal bleeding. This is your gray turner sign. Okay? This is your gray turner sign. What about this one? What about this one? This is actually a radiological image. Again, it came in DEC 2021. Okay. Thank you, West East. Okay, so can you tell me which sign is this which we see on radiograph? What sign do we see on radiograph? Can you tell me? On radiograph, what sign do we see? We see colon cutoff sign. If you can point, if you can see this, it has a colon cutoff sign. Very good. And this came again. This came in your December. Questions get repeated again and again. So very, very, very important. I hope the questions are helpful because I you asked me to get neat PG questions and I've got them. Okay. Okay. Let Can we move ahead? Again, look, what are the signs? That the, This is Cullen sign, periumbilical Echimosis, this is flank sign, it is great, uh, this is on the flanks, it is great turner sign due to, due to retroperitoneal bleeding, so it appears on the flank. Then what is the most specific marker? It is lipase, remember it is lipase, it is very specific to pancreatitis. 
वॉट इज इन्वेस्टिगेशन ऑफ चॉइस सी सी टी और कोलॉन कट ऑफ साइन अगेन इट हैज कम इट हैज कम इन योर एग्जाम तो वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट स्लाइड ऑल द थिंग्स लाइक वट एवर वी कुड गेट वी एडेड हियर ओके नाउ लुक एट दिस अगेन इंपॉर्टेंट आंसर आंसर जल्दी बोल दो वेरी इजी थैंक यू यू ही थैंक यू आई एम सींग वेरी फेमिलियर मेनी फेमिलियर पीपल हियर सो आई एम वेरी हैप्पी हाउ टू फाइंड कोलॉन कट ऑफ साइंस ही दैट विल नॉट बी आस्ट टू यू दे गिव यू अ क्लिनिकल केस ओके एंड इन दैट क्लिनिकल केस दे पॉइंट टूवर्ड्स अ रेडियोग्राफ इट इज हियर द कोलॉन साइन इफ यू कैन सी इट इज हियर ओके इट इज हियर and they will mention symptoms of acute pancreatitis all right so yeah very good very good this is your trans illumination test and this is seen in hydrocel what other questions have come remember that hydrocel closes in 2 years by itself okay hydrocel it disappears by itself koi questions pad liya karo you want me to go fast and then so this is a 46 year old man he notice a painless swelling in the right side of his scrotum so the swelling trans illuminates and you can see the test actually in such questions i'm telling you what is the most likely diagnosis read the last line read the options see the image okay that is enough that is enough that's how you solve questions you ask now how do you solve questions to so, do that okay and remember what is the treatment which has been asked the treatment is that spontaneous closure happens by 2 years if they mention after 2 years what do you do you do herniotomy okay you do herniotomy ya rishab to yahan par 6 year old dal dete hain theek hai my mistake let's put 6 year old okay ये तुम्हें दिख गया है इतने अच्छे से कि ये छोटा है अच्छा तो ये छोटा है तो ये बच्चे का ही होगा अच्छा अच्छा रेशम आई कैन सी वेर यूर गोइंग विद दिस नाउ लुक एट टेस्टिकुलर टॉशन लुक एट टेस्टिकुलर टॉशन ओके थैंक यू कृतिका थैंक यू सो मच लुक एट टेस्टिकुलर टॉशन आई वॉन्ट यू टू रिमेंबर दैट एक ऊपर चला जाता है वाई डज इट गो अप बिकॉज there is turning there is twisting of your goate right so twisting of that leads to one going which one which one goes up the one affected goes up okay affected goes up and this can happen because torsion is predisposing to bell clapper deformity very 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 important again all these are pyqs all these have been asked in neat they have asked in our exam इन ऑल द एग्जाम्स और कुछ है नहीं उनके पास पूछने के लिए तो वॉट इज बेल क्लैप डिफॉर्मिटी कैन यू सी की द शेप दे इफ यू हैव एवर टच ऑल द मेल्स गो टच योर योर ऑर्गन्स एंड सी यू कैन अप्रिशिएट दैट दे आर लॉन्गिट्यूडनल बट वॉट हैपन्स योर इट गोज इट बिकम्स ट्रांसफर्स तो बहुत ईजी है ऐसे पलटाना बहुत ईजी हो जाता है दैट्स वाई इट इज दैट्स वाई it it undergoes torsion it is freely flowing it's like are very good ab to main kahin bhi ja sakta hu yaar and then he understands ki lag gaye <laughs> okay so that's what happens bell clapper's deformity bell clapper's deformity theek hai it is predisposing to testicular torsion which one is up upar kaun sa jata hai that is the affected side look in the image the affected side goes up and another thing friends sign if you touch it if you touch the uh, testicles or aap isko upar karoge if you you know raise it up does the pain disappear the blood vessels are gone pain will not disappear so friends sign will be negative but where is it positive where does touching and pulling it up reduces pain that is epido epidimo or kitis theek hai epidimo or kitis all right so don't forget this very 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 important all these points are important yahi puchte hain yahi aayega okay check kar liya <laughs> okay pratik just uh, i could have seen a lot of patients also theek hai all right let's go to the next question very very important very very important 
वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट या सो दिस इज योर दिस इज योर वेरी गुड इट इज एश ऑफ नॉड्यूल्स रिमेंबर इट इज सीन इन रोमैटिक रोमैटिक हार्ट डिसीज इट इज सीन इन रोमैटिक हार्ट डिसीज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट दिस दिस नॉड्यूल इज सीन इन अगेन वी आर गोइंग टू पैथो नाउ इट इज सीन इन रोमैटिक हार्ट डिसीज वॉट आई वॉन्ट यू टू रिमेंबर देर इज माइट्रल स्टिनोसिस इन दैट एंड दिस क्वेश्चन हैज ऑल्सो कम ड्यू टू That due to the mitral stenosis you can get buttle hole deformity. ठीक है इतना याद रख लेना Rheumatic, rheumatic heart disease के बारे में Okay? Yeah, very good. Revised Jones के very good. तो so, button hole deformity and this inside this you you will have which kind of necrosis is there? Very very important. Again this is a PYQ necrosis which kind? Yes, we get fibrinoid necrosis wherever there is something related to vessels to so, fibrinoid necrosis and one more cells are seen anisco cells right anisco cells these are the two cells that are seen here your fish mouth deformity due to mitral stenosis okay stenosis ho gaya na mitral valve ka you can see the fish also all right theek hai let's go to the next question very 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 important because this comes directly from medicine it comes from patho to to very 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 important okay jones and dukes uh, dukes criteria is seen where where is jones criteria seen and i think jones criteria and dukes criteria we did it in nlc pearls okay to go through the pearls once yeah very good so you can see that the vegetation key points both important hai whenever it comes to vegetations medium size sterile vegetation and associated with sle so this is definitely definitely limbin sac endocarditis okay limbin sac you don't need to see options for this this was very very easy question theek hai limbin sac endocarditis remember both side so what i did i wrote it down theek hai Limbin sac may what do you have to remember? There are small vegetations both the sides. Okay, they are seen on both the sides. Small vegetations. Okay, what about infective endocarditis? You know we use Dukes criteria in in infective endocarditis. You see all these images. I'll just add the images here. Rod spot, which is your retinal hemorrhage, ocular nodule, Janeway lesions. These are very very important images. Plus. how are the vegetations again very 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 important in the exam itself this is what they ask you isme dekh liya they ask you a clinical question and what they, they specify the vegetation medium size sterile so can you see here large irregular friable and destructive vegetations are seen in your infective endocarditis yes imd 13 dmsf yes 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 so they are seen in your infective endocarditis which which valves get involved most commonly again pyq 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 neat fmg everywhere theek hai i've taken this out of neat to this remember your large the large vegetations the only large vegetations are in infective endocarditis they are destructive and in non bacterial thrombotic endocarditis the vegetations are small and bland they are non destructive small bland non destructive nbt large friable destructive infective endocarditis what about your limbin sac remember they are sterile vegetations theek hai these keywords very 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 important medicine bhi solve ho raha hai isse to just go through this important infective endocarditis what are the most common valves involved mitral and aortic theek okay? hai mitral and aortic what about dukes criteria it is in your it is in your infective endocarditis theek hai to please krutika i'll reply you will pass just keep doing this okay just keep doing this don't stop now don't stop now okay this is medicine this is medicine this is in patho it's integrated right it's integrated right samajh gaye you guys understood okay let's go to the next question a 50 year old see i want 
I want you to remember this. आप हमारे साथ बैठे हो हमारी क्लास अटेंड कर रहे हो आप कैसे फील हो गए लास्ट मिनट पे भी यूर सो 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 इंस्पायरिंग बिकॉज यू आर एबल टू इवन दो यू आर एंशियस यूर स्केड यू आर वर्ड अबाउट द एग्जाम यू आर एबल टू सिट इन अ क्लास दैट इट सेल्फ शोज दैट यू आर डेडिकेटेड एंड यू डिजर्व टू पास सो प्लीज जस्ट से आई विल पास बिकॉज यू आर डूइंग अमेजिंग यू आर अमेजिंग डोंट फू गेट दैट ठीक है डोंट फू गेट दैट all right so this is the the one thing i want you to remember about this question is that mpo positivity we have to look at the keywords keywords in the question okay the keyword here is mpo positive this is aml okay this is aml because it the other keyword that it shows is gingival bleeding okay recurrent infection gingival bleeding this is definitely a leukemia why because there is pancytopenia so what are the one liners that you should know about aml okay so firstly what is the most common form of aml it is m2 again all of these have been asked or rods are present in m3 theek okay? hai what about m4 m5 in m4 m5 you see gingival hyperplasia again this was a one liner it was asked in neat pg also in your exam also these are frequently asked questions right which one is associated with down syndrome which one is in associated again that is m7 with down syndrome can you tell me what is the most common most common cardiac defect cardiac anomaly that occurs with because that also have been asked so let's do some pyqs tell me what is the very good that is not it is endocardial cushion defects endocardial cushion defects remember it now if this is not in the options then you can go for atrio atrio ventric ventricular septal defect theek okay? hai atrio ventricular septal defect most common are endocardial cushion defects and this is second most common is atrio ventricles this is a trisomy which one very good it is trisomy 21 okay don't forget this very very important about down syndrome plus you know there is mental retardation and mental retardation you can imagine how many questions are asked your fragile x syndrome your nunan syndrome where else is mental retardation seen remember their iq is less than 70 this is also a pyq so i can go keep going on and on you are 18 trisomy 18 is edward syndrome and you see rocker bottom feet in this right so it's fully in my brain but i don't want to um, like we can go somewhere or fir wapas bhatak ke yahi aana hai hame to let's go back to am aml and what are the stains two stains i want you to remember to distinguish between aml and all tdt pass is for staining all which is all which is more common in children right it is more common in children okay to all all wherever all the क्वेश्चन स्टार्ट विद अ चाइल्ड रिमेंबर अगर लुकीमिया में पूछ रहे हैं तो दे आर आस्किंग यू अबाउट ए एल एल रिमेंबर दे हैव टी डी टी एंड पास पॉजिटिविटी वट अबाउट ए एम एल एम है इसमें तो माइलोपेरोक्सीडीज एंड सूडान ब्लैक इट स्टेन्स बाई माइलोपेरोक्सीडीज एंड सूडान ब्लैक अगेन वेरी 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 इंपॉर्टेंट आई हैव ट्राइड टू कवर एज मच एज पॉसिबल पर लास्ट मिनट है तो आई होप आई होप यू गो थ्रू दिस पी डी एफ ओके Now let's go to the next question. Horner syndrome causes all of the following except Horner syndrome causes all of the following except Okay. It causes all of the following except midriasis it causes honor syndrome again very very important topic for your exam very 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 important topic for your exam remember it causes midri it what they asked except right they asked you an except question yaad rakhna if you don't see except 
if you do not see not in between if you do not see but ya except ya not wo tumhari le lenge theek hai the examiner wants you to not see this question because they they know they can play with your brain par ye sab dekhna hai it does not cause me media acid it causes meiosis okay it causes meiosis how do you remember horner syndrome ek bahut halki pamela hoti hai right horny pamela this was the mnemonic that i yeah it is associated with pancos tumor very good very good how do you remember there is ptosis there is anhydrosis loss of your uh, sweat right and meiosis and ophthalmosis loss of cilospinal reflex theek hai to ek bahut achhi female hai jisse ek mark mil jayega aapko wo dikha kuch aur rahi hai par aapko yaad kuch aur rakhna hai theek hai you she showing you something else but you have to remember something else bhulna mat so this is your horny pamela this is your horny pamela the syndrome yaad rakhna what does it cause it causes meiosis mediasis is seen in mediasis is seen in atropin le lo ya adrof right atropin gives you mediasis what else okay shimmer's test shimmer's test is for yeah okay very good yeah now look at this ogrin line that divides maxillary sinus into superolateral and inferior medial zone is related to is related to yes it is shimmer's test is that test where you put two uh, papers here and keep it for 5 minutes and uh, without the fan ac light and it will show you whether there is dryness in the eyes or not okay so what is answer what is answer it is very good very good very good so it is maxillary carcinoma remember what is ogner's og ongren's line what is ongren's line क्या है ऑन ग्रीन स्लाइन इट इज फ्रॉम योर मीडियल एपिकैंथस टिल योर एंगल ऑफ मैंडुबुला ठीक है एंगल ऑफ मैंडुबुला फ्रॉम योर मीडियल एपिकैंथस सो दिस इज सीन दिस कैन बी यूज्ड फॉर या वेरी गुड प्रोग्ना या वी यूज इट फॉर प्रोग्नोस्टिक इवेल्युएशन ऑफ मैक्सिलरी कार्सिनोमा नाउ दिस वन वेरी सिंपल क्वेश्चन ऑप्था का क्वेश्चन है सिंपल है ठीक है या बिलो गुड अबाउ बैड वेरी गुड वेरी गुड वॉट इज आंसर फॉर दिस अ यंग बॉय विद कंप्लेन्स ऑफ इचिंग वॉटरी आईज राइनोरिया ऑन एग्जामिनेशन सो दिस इज नथिंग बट योर वेरी गुड इट इज वन वेनेरियल कैराटिव कंजेक्टिवाइटिस और इट इज ऑल्सो नोन एज स्प्रिंग कटार ठीक है, इट इज ऑल्सो नोन एज स्प्रिंग कटार सो दिस इज सीजनल राइट एंड यू कैन सी द कॉबल स्टोन अपियरेंस हियर वेर डू यू सी सागो ग्रीन अपियरेंस वेर डू यू सी सागो ग्रीन अपियरेंस दैट इज सीन इन योर ट्रेकोमा राइट तो दिस वॉट काइंड ऑफ डिस्चार्ज इज सीन इन दिस देर इज रोपी डिस्चार्ज वॉट अबाउट बैक्टीरियल कंजेक्टिवाइटिस यू गेट अ म्यूको प्यूरल इन डिस्चार्ज इन दिस राइट यू गेट अ म्यूको प्यूरल इन डिस्चार्ज what about conjectivitis allergic conjectivitis yeah right you get watery discharge theek hai krutika theek hai abhi abhi sahi hoga abhi saath mein kar rahe hai na okay we are doing it together to sahi hoga all right let's go to the next yeah this is your sago grain appearance theek hai this is your sago grain appearance sago green appearance very good now look at this question look at this question a lady presents with pain proptosis orbital swelling loss of vision on examination the given image is noted what is it what is it very good very good very good so you can see that there is erythema there is swelling and it's all around the orbit 
this is orbital cellulitis how do you differentiate between periorbital and orbital remember there is proptosis presence of proptosis you can see the eye protruding out right there is swelling there is fever erythma tenderness so all these are symptoms of your of your orbital cellulitis okay very good very good very good now look at this again a very simple question a very matlab aap samajh sakte ho na ye to question sabne kiya hai yeah this is this is a posterior subcapsular cataract theek hai just look at the image by heart it it is for posterior subcapsular cataract all right let's go to the next image these are images which you jo rati honi chahiye ठीक है जो रटी होनी चाहिए वॉट अबाउट दिस वन वॉट अबाउट दिस वन वेरी गुड दिस इज टोमेटो टोमेटो स्प्लैश अपियरेंस ड्यू टू रेटिनल हेमरेजेस यू कैन सी मल्टीपल रेटिनल हेमरेजेस एंड दैट्स द इमेज दैट इज सी आर वी यू वॉट अबाउट दिस वन वॉट अबाउट दिस वन वेरी ईजी अगेन ये तो मार्क करने पे भी आना चाहिए तो व्हाट इज दिस वन दिस इज योर दिस इज योर चेरी रेड स्पॉट यस इट इज सीन इन नीमन पिक डिसीज आल्सो इट इज सीन इन टी सैक्स आल्सो इट इज सीन इन सी आर ए ओ आल्सो ओके सी आर ए ओ आल्सो वेरी गुड वेरी गुड वेरी गुड very good kora very good shivan very good very good cherry red spot west east i am trying to take a i i wrote it is a mixed image based session right so i am doing questions from all 19 abhi subject wise karke kya milega hame khatam karna hai na pura as much as possible we should be able to finish so i am taking you everywhere let's go on a journey through all 19 <laughs> ठीक है ऐसे ऐसे चलते हैं वॉट इज दिस वॉट इज दिस अ फार्मर प्रेजेंस विद पेन सी विद फार्मर इट सेल्फ यू शुड नो दैट दे आर टॉकिंग अबाउट सम काइंड ऑफ आई इंजरी बिकॉज ऑफ अ स्टिक विच इज रिलेटेड टू वेजिटेटिव मैटर ठीक है वेजिटेटिव मैटर एंड वॉट हैपन्स इन अ वेजिटेटिव मैटर वॉट डू यू गेट वेजिटेटिव मैटर यू गेट पंगल कैरेटाइटिस you get fungal keratitis most common cause of fungal keratitis is some relation to they will mention a farmer or some vegetable matter or something like that which touched and because of that they got fungal keratitis so in the options itself you can see that the best option is natamycin drops okay it is natamycin drops I'm not doing subject wise. I'm doing the most important questions. ठीक है? I'm not doing subject wise. Okay? I'm not doing subject wise. Now look at this. This question: A 14-year-old female presents to the gynecology OPD with the chief complaint of primary amenorrhea. On examination, secondary sexual characters are seen. USG shows normal uterus and ovaries. Which of the following will be next? step of management aap jab exam dete ho to the paper doesn't come subject wise right kuch bhi aa jata hai the first question of yours the person sitting beside you they might have the 149 question which is your first question theek hai my first question was meningioma okay i gave the paper in august 2020 na so i remember there was this whole big question okay aur uske options mein the i remember I got so scared because that was my first question. But in the end of the question, some of my body was written. Okay, directly. I was so happy. I marked it as uh, meningioma. ठीक है तो very good, very good. What is answer? It is reassurance. Why is it reassurance? Remember, she is a fourteen-year-old, and she has secondary sexual characters which are present. When do you? say that it is primary amenorrhea you see it when the female is 14 years old without secondary sexual characters without secondary sexual characters what about 
if she has secondary sexual characters then she is she has to be 15 years old okay after that only you tell ki uh, aapki beti shayad kuch hoga usko so this was me okay i was 14 i had no secondary sexual characters and i still did not get so my mother got very worried she was like isko kya ho gaya maine londe ko janam de diya and i think that's why i was supposed to be a guy and i ended up a girl what is the best investigation for primary menorrhea remember it is karyotyping theek hai main pehle attempt mein pass ho gayi thi and i got 189 theek hai now look at this a 19 year old female presents to the gynecology opd with weight loss and secondary amenorrhea she has a constant fear of gaining weight alteration in which of the following is responsible for this for this responsible for this which one is responsible for this sorry 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 this is not this is reassurance okay i told you already it is reassurance she has secondary sexual characters and she's 14 years old so wait till she crosses 15 okay thank you mudit yeah so what do you what is the cause of this wherever stress is coming wherever constant fear psychiatric symptoms anything it is related to growth hormone okay excessive exercising excessive exercising or anxiety stress anorexia bulimia brain tumors gnrh is affected when is your anterior pituitary affected you remember anterior pituitary necrosis which happens uh, in shihan syndrome okay that's where your because of that there is reduced lh and fsh so remember here there the cause is gnrh if they asked you in shihan syndrome the cause is the cause is anterior pituitary necrosis due to that what happens there is decrease in lh and fsh what about your ovary your turner syndrome you know it is they have streaky ovaries right so estrogen and progesterone will be affected in that okay so very very important table very very important table and one question usually comes from this okay one usually one question usually comes from this so the answer is gnrh the answer is gnrh see it is uh, it is 14 in some books it is 15 in some books you study what it is reassurance it is reassurance okay it is reassurance i by mistakenly marked the wrong answer very good very good okay very good let's go to the next question this is actually yeah what is the answer for this a 29 year old female presented presented la beta <laughs> i think main hu beta jo beti ban gayi a 29 year old female presented to the opd with symptoms of lower abdominal pain and dyspareunia but adnexal tenderness adnexal tenderness cervical motion tenderness what is the most likely diagnosis i think from this question itself it is giving you enough symptoms to diagnose this so yes you are right you are right is it it is pid and this is the diagnostic criteria right bilateral lower abdominal pain adnexal tenderness cervical motion tenderness matlab aap daloge andar aur move karoge to there will be pain right this is a diagnostic triad so pid again you can go through this remember the most common cause is chlamydia okay chlamydia and what are the symptoms used in this pain pain when also which worsen after coitus what is coitus jo aap closed band darwazon ke piche karte ho par aajkal bahut sare log hai jinko public mein bhi karna pasand hai to pain after that all right uterine tenderness cervical motion cervical matlab andar ghusa ke aise karoge to yeah and added nexal tenderness what is the investigation of choice not important this is important what is this this is your perihepatic 
string of violin appearance right string of violin appearance it is also seen in it is also seen in pid and fitz hergis syndrome i think you know what about this one this is which investigation is this very 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 important very very important why because this investigation has been asked in your neat and neat questions get repeated continuously your septate uterus was asked okay so very 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 important investigation remember this is your hysterosalpingography hysterosalpingography okay so you can see the cannula also has been asked it is a leech wilkinson cannula this cannula is known as leech wilkinson cannula okay now you can see this is the uterus these are your fallopian tubes and the fallopian you put a dye inside it that has to flow here okay there is no flowing but there is a block which kind of block it is distal it is this side and it is at the end right it is not in the starting you can see it is not in the starting of the fallopian tube it is at the distal end so this is a bilateral distal block also known as a hydrosalpinx okay which is seen in your pid associated with your pid very 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 important please 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 uh, go through this okay bilateral coronal block is the block which is here okay and hysterosalpingography why do you do it because the patient will come to you because of infertility okay some cause of infertility they'll come or you can do it for your uh, uh, uterine congenital malformations right so coronal block the most common cause of that is your physiological spasm physiological spasm aa gaya physiology yes sir heard physiology so, and he came back transportation everything so it's very hectic time last the three days the most common yeah. cause is physiological spasm yes. after that yes. okay okay yes sir has come back so just go through this yes. very very important now last question of obigaimi before we go to some other subject yeah ashi ashi sir le rahe hai kal medicine <laughs> yeah yeah kal pakka le rahe hai yeah. unmarried female 33 why itna late sara sir aapne kyun nahi ki shaadi i i have different to, reason uh, different reason. unmarried male age is 20 25 30 okay unmarried ha unmarried 57 year old male <laughs> teacher ha huh? ha who has a history of dental amalgam yeah yeah who will get lichen planus yeah 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 or or bhi kuch hai na or or cetriasis kyunki aapka to isliye shaadi nahi ki na are shaadi nahi ki na sahi baat hai we have to marry a cetriasis person marry a nymphomania then they are cetriasis both... it is turkiness very excessive yeah. turkiness in male yeah. jo bahut bahut bhar bhar ke hai theek hai and nymphomania ah, ah, i think right? i spell likh ke sara ko roz message karta hu i have satiriasis <laughs> khud se khud se just because i had multiple affair that doesn't mean just because satiriasis. you did not get married because <laughs> i know i know it now <laughs> ki you wanted to test different different theories okay, different okay. Di- different practical experiences yes <laughs> <laughs> kyunki satiriasis hai maybe <laughs> so what is the answer for this yes, yes it is the first she has dekho sir 33 she, year old unmarried yeah, female bilkul hai usko abhi se chief complaint oh. of secondary amenorrhea she My she was having yeah, regular yeah. menses okay theek okay, hai until now hmm. so ab everything appears normal in the pelvic examination so But what is the she pu- pucha intercourse ki nahi <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah the word nahi dala yahan pe pehle pucho to sahi kiya nahi kiya क्या पता वो कुछ वो सिस्टर हो नन हो नहीं हम नहीं मानते अब के जमाने में हो सकता है वही थ्योरी है ना चलो यूपीडी करेंगे ठीक है यूपीडी करेंगे ओके व्हाट इज द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन लुक एट इट वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन ये आ गया ना बार बार इस पे लगा दिया कर चैट में ना हमेशा इसको टॉप चैट से लाइव चैट कर दिया तो से लाइव आएगा देखा दिख रहा है कितने हंसी मजाक दिख रहे हैं बच्चे इस स्पैम वाला कौन आ गया भाई चलो एक 
है जो बार बार पूछ रहे मैं पास हूँ या नहीं हूँ वो ज्यादा मैसेज करेगा तो नंबर कम है हर मैसेज में एक नंबर कम है भाई जितनी बार स्पैम करोगे एक मैसेज एक नंबर कम एंड इमेजिन यू गेटिंग वन फिफ्टी एक मैसेज और करता तो गड़बड़ हो सकती थी तो दिस इज दिस इज एक्चुअली ग्रीनिश वजाइनल डिस्चार्ज फिर कभी किया आपने जिसके साथ नहीं नहीं इट्स अ एब्सोल्यूट नो नो सो दिस इज पहले कंसेंट लो इंस्पेक्शन करो कंसेंट इंस्पेक्शन इज अ मस्ट इट इज सीन इन ट्राइकोमोनियासिस सर ये इसमें सेक्सुअल पार्टनर को ट्रीट करते हैं या नहीं करते इमेजिन यू हैड सेट्रियासिस बहुत बहुत करना ही था करना ही था करना ही था तो आपने कर लिया ओके okay. ठीक है पर आपको विदाउट कॉन्डम पसंद है <laughs> <laughs> कुछ भी कुछ भी मतलब मुझे no. भी इन्फेक्शन हुआ तो डू नाउ शी हैज अ एंग्री लुकिंग वजाय ना तो इस आई आई लव टू बी एंग्री ना कि तुमने बताया नहीं कांड कर दिया इट्स मे विल यू व्हाट डू यू हैव टू डू डू यू ट्रीट द पार्टनर डेफिनेटली ये एचटीडी है यू ट्रीट द पार्टनर तभी क्या वही उसको बैक्टीरियल में डोंट डू विदाउट प्रोटेक्शन ओके सही है तो यस हियर यू गिव एंटीबायोटिक्स यू हैव टू ट्रीट द पार्टनर बोथ यू हैव टू ट्रीट द पार्टनर ओके यू हैव टू ट्रीट द पार्टनर बिकॉज़ बिल्कुल बिल्कुल बिकॉज़ स्पेशली विदाउट कंडम प्लीज यार प्लीज अवॉइड इट अवॉइड प्लीज अवॉइड इट यस यस इफ यू डोंट वांट एनी गुड न्यूज़ ओके तो एंग्री लुकिंग वजाइना व्हाट डू यू सी ऑन कल्चर You see motility. Okay, don't forget that bacterial vaginosis. Now, sir, दूसरी लड़की से मिले क्योंकि शादी दूसरी नहीं है तो एक के साथ तो टिकी के नहीं तो that female has a greyish discharge. ठीक है greyish discharge. Now, do you have to treat the partner? Do you treat sir? No, you don't treat here because there is only a change in flora here. Yes. Okay, so no need to treat treat the sexual partner. Yes. What about candidiasis? Yes. If she had a curdy white discharge, okay. और सर वो लाइक अरे ये बहुत वेट ओके सो हियर यू ट्रीट इफ ही गेट्स सिम्टम्स ओके इचिंग होगा सोचने में इचिंग हाँ वेरी वेरी इंटेंस इचिंग यस एंड स्मेल आल्सो फाउल कैन कम पर आपको तो कोई फर्क नहीं पड़ता क्या मुझे आना व्हाट इज़ इट ड्रग ऑफ़ चॉइस मल्टीपल एनाउंसमेंट ओके ड्रग ऑफ़ चॉइस इन ट्रैक देखो कहां जा रहा है जा रहा है क्रॉस कर रहा है नहीं कर रहा क्या है बताओ दिस इज योर वेरी गुड वेरी गुड वेरी गुड ये टेडी जी मैं क्या इज दिस टेडी गो जाएगा ना इट विल गो गो टू द पीपल पीपल तक नहीं जा तो यार सो दिस इज यस पिंगुला पिंगुल गुल ठीक है ठीक है टेरिजियम वी सी गो इट गोस या इट गोस इट गोस टू द पीपल इट गोस टू द पीपल वेरी गुड Let's go to the and spring got out. So, what did you do? Yes. Okay. Rope is shy. That's not good. Yeah. Rope, it's a. And what is it? Cobblestone. Cobblestone appears. Sago green. Sago green is trachoma. Oh, yes, sir. You have passed. You have passed. You have passed. You have passed. Okay. <laughs> what about this one? A mother, hmm. one and a half years old. Absolutely. Child give history of a white reflex from oh, one eye one. for the past one hmm. month. On CT calcification is seen. Photo भी दिखा दें. What is the answer? Photo देखते बता देंगे बच्चे. No, without the photo. बताओ. Calcification means what? ठीक है चलो photo भी दिखा देते हैं. ये सबसे famous. बुरा बुरा लगेगा. Yes. वरना. Yes. बताओ बताओ. Need PG में bit out spot आया था ठीक है. तो by chance I saw it was not But I think there was a question on pterygium also, maybe. Okay, चलो. <coughs> ये सबको आता है disease. Yes, this सबका is your favorite. retinoblastoma. Yes. It is an RG RB gene defect, right? कौन सा वाला gene defect है इसमें? RB. Chromosome बताओ बच्चों. Chromosome. 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 सबको आता है ये सब बच्चों को आता है देखिए. Yes. Very और good. ये famous है नेल्सन. Thirteen. तेरा क्यों चौदह? 
और क्या होता है चौदह वेलेंटाइन डे रोज देते हो रोज रोजेट दिखता है क्या दिखता है ट्रू रोजेट कौन सा फ्लैक्सनर विंटर स्टाइनर रोजेट क्या दिखेगा इसमें रोजेट ट्रू रोजेट बीच में एम टी स्पेस दिखेगा बोलना नहीं है ठीक है तेरा क्यों चौदह तेरा क्यों चौदह इसमें कोई वल गारंटी नहीं है वल गारंटी इज इन माइंड ओके नॉट इन टीचिंग या तेरा क्यों चौदह बिल्कुल देखो चौदह वहा बच्चे बढ़ गए पांच सौ ग्यारह वेरी गुड एंड तक रहने चाहिए साढ़े पांच सौ अच्छा <clears throat> so this is your, this is your very good, very good. So this is your lish nodules. Yes. It is seen in which one? तो हमने pearl बनाया था याद है फिर? Yes. ये देखो, ये NLC pearls है जो we started. Very good. Okay. Very good. So ये आप देख सकते हो. NF1 it arises from, it arises from which chromosome? Chromosome 17. Yes. NF2 chromosome 22. Yes. And what kind of Changes do you see in the eye? Lish nodules. Okay? Lish nodules. Then what is this? This is your fibromas. Hai. Yes. What else? This is your cafe. All you. Very important. Very, very important. All of these cafe are MCQs, all right? Cafe all you. Yes. Fibroma. Okay? So, please go through this pearl. We have done medicine ke liye especially because we have done it. We will do. Yeah. Yes. So, it's very important. Yes. All right. Very good. Very good. Now look at this question. Dharma pe chalte hain. Good na? Dharma pe chalte hain. Ah, chalte hain. Dharma pe chalte hain. Yes. Very good. This is your alopecia areata. Yes. Kis ko hai sir ye? Ye I think apni team hai. Yeah. So okay, we I have a have... team member with this yes, this yes. so we remember it very well yes. okay so what is it it is a yes. complete hair loss circular or kya dikhta hai aapko jab aap wo broken hair yahan se nikaloge exclamation mark exclamatory mark okay yes. exclamation mark yes. very very important and what is the treatment of choice intralesional steroids. steroid plus wo ek drug aata hai na jo dete hain hum log yes. kya lagate hain kiska dil wo minoxi dil dil minoxi dil minoxi ka dil lagate hain aap ke lambe baal honge na minoxi aapko to pata hai aapko to triacid hai na are yaad karne ke mnemonic banaye hain zaruri hai acha okay alopecia it can come down for you it can come yahi to puchte hain yes do hi aata hai to male pattern aayega ya fir alopecia areata okay and you can identify If it's जो सब अपने जो होंगे ना अंकल दादा उनको देख लो देखो, ये वाला ये देखो ये, देखो ये, <laughs> ये कौन सा है ये 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 हेलमेट वाला ये आपका हो जाएगा ठीक है चलो आगे चलते हैं ठीक है लेट्स गो टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन ये जो आपको होने वाला है ओहो फिर से कितनी बार दिखाओगे सब तुम बार बार चलो भाई चलो ठीक है अगेन रीड द लास्ट लाइन वॉट इज द डायग्नोसिस आंसर इमेज से ही पता चल जाएगा एनएलसी पर्ल्स गेटिंग दिल्ली ब्रांच ठीक है तो ये दिस इज सीन इन योर लाइक इन प्लेनेस ठीक है दिस इज सीन इन योर लाइक इन प्लेनेस क्या होता है इसमें देर इज लेसी रेटिकुलर पैटर्न ओके लेसी रेटिकुलर पैटर्न एंड लेट्स गो थ्रू द इमेजेस ऑफ लाइक इन प्लेनेस वन मोर क्वेश्चन आई वॉन्ट यू टू डू बिफोर वी गो टू द इमेज ऑफ सोरियासिस एंड लाइक इन प्लेनेस क्योंकि वॉट आर दीज दीज आर योर कितना पीछे चल रहा है दीज आर योर पैपलोस क्लूमस डिजीज राइट वॉट अबाउट दिस वन विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज नॉट सीन इन द इमेज गिवन बिलो सो एनी वेज दिस इज द इमेज दिस इज मुंड्रोज माइक्रो एप्सिस इट इज एक्चुअली नॉट सीन इन इट इज नॉट सीन इन लाइक इन प्लेनस एवरी थिंग एल्स योर इज सीन इन लाइक इन प्लेनस ठीक है This is Munro's microapsis. It is seen in psoriasis. Psoriasis. Okay. This one, neutrophilic microapsis. 
Now, what is the predisposing factor of lichen planus? It is dental amalgam. आपने कभी आपको कभी cavity हुई है जिसकी वजह से वो mercury filling डालने पड़ती है. So this is a <coughs> it is a predisposing factor for Atulia. Pani. Factor for dental amalgam. What about this? Remember four things in this. Lichen planus is purple. It is pruritic. It has papules. As you can see, these are the papules here. Okay, these are the papules and it has plaques. So, ye aapke plaques ho ga. Okay, purple pruritic papules plaques. The four Ds of your lichen planus. Okay, plus it has became stray. Dekho, it has again placey reticular yes. pattern. Okay, become stray. And this in your oral mucosa. Okay, so these are all images from lichen planus are relevant. Hai. Plus this one, then you will know this is the Cobner's phenomena. Yes. On the line of trauma, mm -hmm. a me. new lesion appears. Okay, yes. so Cobner's phenomena is seen in three diseases. Yes. Very, very important MCQ. It is seen in lichen planus. It is seen in psoriasis. So it becomes an accept question. It is seen in psoriasis. It is seen in vitiligo. ठीक है, remember this very 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 important, very good very good very good guy three Siri Chandra Alia very very good. So what are the nail changes in lichen planus? It is your pterygium. One is seen in eye, one in nails. So ये lichen planus का characteristic feature है, very very important. It is a characteristic feature of lichen planus. There is anokia also and pup tint sign. दिख रहा है सर आपको पप टेंट जिसमें आप और कोई लड़की फॉरेस्ट में फॉरेस्ट में क्यों जाएंगे पप टेंट साइन जब शहर में इतनी जगह हैं तो फॉरेस्ट में इतनी दूर सिर्फ वो आपको तो सब जगह पता है सब पता है तो या तो दिस इज़ द पप टेंट साइन इट इज़ सीन इन लाइकन प्लानेस ऑल दिस आर नील चेंजेस इन लाइकन Oil drop oil down. down. Yes, yes, yes. This is a pathonomic change in your psoriasis. Yes. This came in NEAT PG 22. So, I will tell you how to do this when I have an exam. No, no, no. So, psoriasis, how are the lesions? If you can, I told you this was seen in lichen planus. This is in psoriasis. How do you differentiate more silvery? More silvery is like is psoriasis. Can you see there are silvery, silvery lesions? What about your purple pe, pe, uh, what papules for those are those are seen in lichen planus. Okay? These are seen in lichen planus. So this is your psoriasis. Which sign is seen? It is auspit sign. Kya hota hai? When you remove the flakes, you get pinpoint bleeding, right? So that is auspit sign. Nail changes, there, uh, there is pits, which is very common. Can you see the pits? There is subungal hyperkeratosis. This is a PYQ. So psoriasis, yeah, lichen planus say one question confirmed. In NEAT, now they asked about this oil change. Okay, this is your subungal hyperkeratosis. You can see because of the hyperkeratosis, the nail bed has come up. Okay, the nail bed has come up. If you can appreciate. So this is your subungal hyperkeratosis. Then what is this? This is your oil drop. Oil drop sign. Where is your oil drop cataract seen? Tell me that too. Sir, where is the oil drop cataract? Tell me, galactosemia. Galactosemia. Let's remember that in galactose, what is it? Milk. Milk is made of ghee. What do you do with ghee? Oil. Then you cook it in ghee. मुझे लगा आप कुछ डर्टी निमोनिक बनाओगे नो डर्टी ना आपकी मुझ से इतना अच्छा निमोनिक अच्छा नहीं लग रहा वो पारस बनाता है डर्टी डर्टी पारस बनाता है सारे ऑल डर्टी डर्टी या वेरी गुड वेरी गुड तो व्हाट आर दिस दिस आर योर पस्टुल ऑफ कोयोज एंड मुंडरोस माइक्रोएब्सेस बस याद रखना both of these are seen in psoriasis. Okay? These are seen. Just remember the names. Because names can come as options. Okay? Itna yaad rakh lena. What is this now? What is this now? This is... This is... Very good. A patient presents with the following lesion. 
you can see it is hypopigmented along one side along one dermatome ठीक है one dermatome dermatome का मतलब it has its own vein yes, nerve, nerve supply. Yes. arterial supply so this is vitiligo it is segmented yes, along one dermatome एक और चीज होती है along one dermatome बताओ भाई कौन सा वायरस इन्फेक्शन है यस वेरी गुड सर आपको सब पता है आई एम अ टीचर ना टीचर शुड नो आई टीच ऑल शिंगल्स यस तो मैं बीच बीच में ना मैं बहुत इंप्रेस होती रहती हूँ सर कि अभी मैं नहीं आता इसके साथ मैं क्या ज़्यादा इंप्रेस हो गई फिर पूरा टाइम बोले सर मुझे पढ़ाओ मुझे पढ़ाओ म Varicella zoster, ठीक है Varicella zoster, again PYQ along one dermatome. Vitiligo, remember depigmented macules. I told you Cobner's phenomena. It is seen in three places. One is psoriasis, lichen planus, and your vitiligo. ठीक है? What about this one? A patient presents with multiple blisters on the skin and oral mucosa. The immunofluorescent staining for IgG shows the following characteristic pattern. Which of the following target? So, isme you can see the fishnet pattern, right? Fishnet pattern. Jo kis me dikhta hai? Kis me dikhta hai? Kis me dikhta hai fishnet pa pattern? It is seen in pemphigus. Pemphigus. Very good, very good. Vulgaris. And what is the defect in pemphigus vulgaris? There are antibodies against. There are antibodies against desmosomes, okay? Desmoglin actually, which is in your desmosomes. Which ones? 3 and 1. Okay, what is the target protein? And you can see this is your pemphigus vulgaris. It is a bullous disorder. You can appreciate the flaccid bully here. Okay, these are the bully. Okay, let's go to the next question. What is this? Sir, you are Sir, how much are I have thousands of All the students who are studying, they are all like my kids. So one reason I am not married is, when you have so many kids to take care of, it is difficult to take care of your own kid. So I am doing... Satriyas is it. There is no reason that Satriyas. Here I am talking about sacrifice. This is what I have to say. Okay. So this is a cradle cap. Yes. The child is sleeping in Ashik Sir's face. Because he has been doing a lot of travel. Okay. So that child is in pain right now. He has got dermatitis now. Which kind of dermatitis? You know, it is seboric dermatitis. Okay, cradle cap, nasolabial foreplay, yellowish, greasy, right? Yes. Yellowish, greasy. That, yeah, so yellowish, greasy. What other dermatitis should you know? You should know contact dermatitis. Remember, it is a type 4 hypersensitivity. Very, very important. This has been asked. Type 4 hypersensitivity. Which one? Contact dermatitis. What about seboric? Greasy yellow scales on the nasolabial fold. Yeah. Cradle cap. It is your seboric dermatitis. Then you have atopic dermatitis, which is a type 1 hypersensitivity. Which is type 4, sir? Contact. और अटॉपिक कौन सा है? टाइप वन, ठीक है? व्हाट इज़ अ ट्राइड फॉर दिस? देयर इज़ एन अटॉपिक ट्राइड वेर यू गेट अटॉपिक डर्मेटाइटिस, लाइक एक्जिमा, एलर्जिक राइनाइटिस एंड अटॉपिक एस्मा, जो सर को है। हाँ, बिल्कुल। ओके, व्हाट इज़ अ ट्रीटमेंट? यू गिव टॉपिकल स्टेरॉइड्स या Allergy condition, type 1 hypersensitivity, you can even give stabilizer, master stabilizer, chromoglycate etc. How many MCQ in exam? There will be 300. Yes, there will be 300 MCQs. We love you Ashi sir, we love you Ashi sir. I also love you all, okay? It's cool. I'll handle it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So contact is type 4. Contact is type 4 and your atopic is type 1. What about your allergic? That is also type 4. Allergic dermatitis is also type 4. Remember this, it is very important. What about this question? A 5 year old child is brought to the OPT with hypopigmented finely scaly 
finely scaly patches on her face. There is a history of atopy in the family. What is the clinical diagnosis? What is the clinical diagnosis? So you can see there are hypopigmented macules. Okay, hypopigmentations is yes. there. And plus the age is very, very important here. So what is the diagnosis here? Jaldi bata do, jaldi bata do. What is the diagnosis? It is your alba. Very good, very good. What about your pityriasis versicolor? What kind of? And we also have no treatment required. Very good, very good. So this is pityriasis alba. Okay. What about this one? An asthmatic child presents with intensely pruritic lesions. He has no other symptoms. What is the most likely diagnosis? What is the most like? Very good. Pityriasis versicolor. It is caused by Malaysia furfur. It came now last. Which appearance dikta hai? Koi ball wala appearance dikta hai? Which one? <laughs> it is spaghetti and meatball appearance, right? But in India, mein kaun khata spaghetti and meatball? Sir, aap. Aise yaad kar lo. Noodle nahi hote noodle. Chowmin. Chowmin me. ऐसे फाइबर पड़े होंगे ऐसे ऐसे These are the ठीक है और कलर चेंज करना सारा इसका इधर इधर चेंज दिख जाएगा जहाँ ये दिख गया समझ जाएगा ठीक है डन है तो ये रिप्रेजेंट करते हैं हाईफे को ये स्पोर्ट्स को ठीक है ये कह रहा भूख लग गई भूख लग गई हाई साहब ये सब देख के अगर तुम्हें रिमेम्बर अबाउट दही कड़ी वाइन डिस्चार्ज और सोच रहा है दही जाके खाना ठीक है नाउ लुक एट दिस एन एस्मेटिक चाइल्ड प्रेजेंट्स विद इंटेंसली प्रोराइटिक लीजेंस ही हैज नो अदर सिम्टम्स व्हाट इज द मोस्ट लाइकली डायग्नोसिस व्हाट इज द मोस्ट लाइकली डायग्नोसिस व्हाट इज द मोस्ट लाइकली डायग्नोसिस दिस इज योर okay remember it the where is this lesion shown to you it is shown to you in the flexor flexor region right plus there is intensely pruritic lesions there are no other symptoms so this is nothing but eczema okay this is eczema there is flexor distribution and what is the what is what are the clinical features there is constant itching there is hyperpigmentation lichenification exaggerated skin markings theek hai these are all symptoms of dekh lena kahan ho raha hai flexors pe eczema hota hai theek hai how many image questions in the exam sir last time kitne aaye the last time around 40 so i think same 30 40 we are guessing 30 to 40 theek hai okay agar zyada aa gaya to koi baat nahi hai theek hai भूल जाना कि आ गए कम आ गए तो भी कोई बात नहीं बी पॉजिटिव सी इवन इफ दे डू नॉट आस द इमेजेस दे आस दे डिस्क्राइब द इमेजेस राइट लास्ट टाइम एक क्वेश्चन आया था हॉलमैन मिलर का दे डिडंट गिव द इमेज बट दे सेड एंटीरियर बोइंग इन द मैक्सिलरी साइनस तो वो क्या है इट इज एन इमेज बेस्ड क्वेश्चन यस बस आपको इमेज नहीं दिख रही इट इज अ इनविजिबल इमेज बेस्ड क्वेश्चन ठीक है दिस व्हाट इज दिस दिस इज अगेन एक्जिमा फ्लेक्सर पे है ना and hyperpigmentation hai constant itching okay how many questions from previous year it depends last time around 50 60 were there this time also 50 60 to pakad ke chalo aate hi hai isse hi aayenge plus chanting plus ashish sir ka medicine agar aap miss kar rahe ho aap pagal ho क्यों लास्ट टाइम वी टुक अ सेशन फॉर थ्री आवर्स राइट और उससे कितने क्वेश्चंस डायरेक्टली वी गॉट टेन इलेवन क्वेश्चंस जस्ट फ्रॉम दोस थ्री आवर्स सो यू कैन नॉट मिस आशीष सर सेशन टुमारो ओके ओके व्हाट अबाउट दिस वन दिस इज योर निविस ऑफ ओटा ठीक है निविस ऑफ ओटा विच नर्व इन्वॉल्वमेंट इज देयर देर इज ट्राइजेमिनल नर्व इन्वॉल्वमेंट ठीक है फेस वॉट अबाउट यूर निविस ऑफ आइटो ये आइटो है ना 
So there is brachial plexus involvement here. That's why it's on the arm. What about this one? So ye, ye aapka port wine stain. Yes. A very this famous leader needed? had port wine stain. Anyone can tell me which famous world leader is having port wine stain? Very famous world leader. Let's see who is the answer. Okay, so this is your port wine stain. This is not the answer. This is the answer. Okay, Mikhail Gorbachev, the last leader of USSR, he had port wine. He is very famous for that photo of having the port wine, but he had in the forehead. Okay. So this is your yes. Sturge Weber syndrome. Sturge. Very good. Where do you see Dawson fingers? Dawson fingers. Ye to Ashish sir ke notes mein. Yes. Please go through Ashish sir's medicine notes. Yes. Aap medicine pad bhi nahi rahe ho. Yes. So you can solve all the yes. questions. Yes. Dawson fingers. Where do you see them? This is seen in multiple sclerosis. Very good. It is seen in multiple sclerosis. Yes. What about this one? Easily question kana bona. Sare sahi. Thik hai? Uh, all easily question they can do in the group. Wow. Thik hai? You... And what do you, you know what he does? He takes out the telegram questions, okay? We yeah. are the ones posting it. Uske baad, jaise ki jeete indir ho gaya, wo post kar raha hai. To sir, pehle kya karte hai? Dekhte, dekhte, sab solve karte hai. Kuch gar bana. To he checks ki mera group, in log barbaat kar rahe hai, ya abad kar rahe hai. Nah, if mistake akka, we have to correct. And you know what he does? He takes a screenshot of that. Dekh ta raha, mere poore questions correct hai. Yeah, nah, teach it. And every time the questions are posted, sab correct hai, line se. So it's very irritating if a genius man is your mentor. <laughs> what is the answer for this? Very good, very good. You do. Sir, what is this? Is this your girlfriend? Okay, so what happened to this? Tell me. It's like this. How much love is this? You thought this is what is this? No, no. It's like this. Where can you see this from other people? If a person is hypertensive, again you can see. Mala flush. That is not called a rash. Rash is almost permanent. Flush keep coming and going. So, hypertension you can see, Mahalar Frush. Yeah, very good. This is seen in, Aray, yaar, ye bohat famous, Butterfly Rash. Yes. It is seen in SLE. What are the antibodies related to that? Very important. Sir, very body, more specific concern. Hmm, patao. That is your? Smith. Smith. Anti-Smith antibody. Thik hai? Anti-Roh kis mein dikhta hai? It is seen in? Yes. Neonatal lupus. Yes. And why lupus? Roh can also be seen in which other condition? Roh or kaan dikh sakta hai? Bata do. Roh. रो, where else रो रोता नहीं है ना, रोना नाक से पानी, इसमें मुंह से पानी नहीं आता, yes, it can be seen in which condition? It can be seen in zogrens, very good, zogrens, क्या तुम्हें सिर्फ पिला दो, पानी पिला दो, पायलो कार्पेन, ठीक है या सभी में लाइन भी किया दे सकते हैं, yes, very important, dryness ना, पूरी tightening हो जाती है, I read it, I read it, so why और kidney involvement में क्या दिखता है? Why do patients very very important? They will give you a case and they will tell this. ठीक है? और heart में Lipman sac endocarditis. Lipman sac. मैंने अभी पढ़ा है था पता है? Very important topic. Sir 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 आप इनको बताओ कि vegetative I'll show you. I just thought them. देखो you can see vegetations. Yeah. ठीक है? So this is a very important topic. Can you see the vegetations? ये growth. Yeah. Okay. So if you are getting the vegetation 100% portion is there, okay, clear? And they are on both the sides. Can you see that? Both the sides. Yes. Okay, sterile vegetations. You can see. Sterile मतलब infective तो हो नहीं सकता. देखो logic लगा लो. Sterile मतलब is not infective. And non-infective में most common you will get the acidly limbic sac. Very important. And I told them all the lesions. It's hundred percent. अरे बाप. Duke's criteria also. It's a hundred percent important. ठीक है. And इसको याद रखना है. भूलना नहीं है. ठीक है. चल. Okay. Very very good. Let's go to our thing again. You want charger? We will go to the next question. Eight minutes to go. Yeah. So this was your SLE. What causes SLE? Can you tell me some drugs? Yes, very good. Ship drugs. Very, very, very important. SLE cause karte hai. S for sulfonamide, hydralazine, then you have your isoniazid and finally your procanamide. Okay, procanamide. Or procanamide, sir, where do we give it? Mira, Mira, type C. Procanamide, it also causes, it is used for, it is used for, it is a drug of choice for, can you tell me, it is a drug of choice for?
it is the drug, drug of choice for yeah very good thank you so much tumhara charge hai okay now look at this different disease look at this what is the next question what is the next question what is what is the answer for this which of the following diseases is closely related to enteropathy which of the following diseases is closely related to enteropathy okay so very good this is an extra intestinal manifestation of what disease dermatitis herpetiformis what is it it is a gluten hypersensitivity right gluten hypersensitivity and what is the antibody against it epidermal transglutaminase what do you avoid in this you avoid ye na mnemonic hai you avoid barley rye oat and wheat can you give rice yes you can give rice and this is occurring due to gluten hypersensitivity so how do you what do you do with this what do you do and on histopath ek ek finding hamesha hoti hai what is the finding there is villus atrophy theek hai there is villus atrophy there is villus atrophy theek hai so sir celiac disease ka bhi bol rahi thi main wow, bro yes bro 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 to bro nahi bolna chahiye kisi ko bhi wo bolta hai bro give me some money no. <laughs> bro you are looking sexy bata paisa mang raha hai तो ब्रो डोंट से ब्रो टू एनीवन यस आप क्यों नहीं बोलते क्योंकि आप मैं तो सबको भाई बोलता हूं ब्रो क्या बोलता हूं क्या अंग्रेज हैं तो ब्रो क्या भाई बोलते हैं ठीक है तो यू कैन या सो दिस इज फॉर ऑल द पीपल हु विल पास दिस ग्रेट ट्रॉफी दिस इज फॉर ऑल ऑफ यू व्हेन यू पीपल क्लियर द एग्जाम थोड़ा ठीक है यू कैन रीड यू कैन सी दिस इज एक्चुअली मेड ऑफ ग्लास सो It's still here. Yeah. You spend grieving yeah. For Aapke, all of you after you pass. Everybody who passes gets this from NLC. We have upgraded ourselves. Okay, we have upgraded. We have spent more money this time. Yeah. For a pass, a lot of laga is. Because you are worth it. Yes. You are worth it. We have all thousand such short shield swapy because we know more than thousand people are going to we'll pass. Well, definitely pass. Our kids, who. integrated learning ke wo bhi so we have made this and we are waiting for you to come yes. get it from us plus you will get a certificate just by ashish sir ke sign only <laughs> so you can yes. keep it as an autograph yes and photo also with us will you arrange goa trip after sure, exams sure 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 bas yahi karte rehte hain hum log theek hai goa theek hai theek hai bas aap paisa de dena uske liye <laughs> okay go goa go on What about this one, sir? ये तो आपका फेवरेट क्वेश्चन है। अरे रिपीट ये पीवाई क्यों है तो बताइए। ये सबको पता होगा। इसके लिए देश में मारा मारी हुई। Even died. Yes, COVID में, COVID में this was the biggest, biggest requirement. Yeah. ठीक है। सब ने आंसर सही दिया। वाव। That's great. अरे यार ये क्यों बीच में आ जा रहा है? ये आ रहा है या आ रही है? वीक सारा संडे संडे क्या करते हैं संडे को सिर्फ मजे लेने ठीक है फिर फिफ्थ एलिमेंट याद है हाउ मेनी एलिमेंट आर दियर पंच तत्व पांच तो एलिमेंट वन फाइव टू फाइव थ्री फाइव तो वन फाइव टू फाइव द फर्स्ट एलिमेंट जिसमें बिना सांस नहीं ले सकते एयर एयर इज then what is the most important gas in the air oxygen. oxygen so oxygen is this and what is the remaining air 80% nitrogen nitrogen so n2 nitrous oxygen fir yaad karna thakka teen chhakke 3c rc ye kya hai ccc so 16 26 36 sare ccc easy ho gaya sare c hai chhakke 6 6 1 6 2 6 3 teen chhakke cycle pe teen chhakke cycle pe cyclo so imagine teen chhakke aise cycle chala rahe hai 6 साइक्लोप्रोपेन 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 ये दोनों कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड 
तो बहुत है कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड थोड़ा कॉन्ट्रोवर्शियल है सेवन परसेंट है कोई कहता मोर देन सेवन परसेंट लेस देन सेवन परसेंट आप याद करो सीओ टू ना सीओ टू क्या है गंदी गंदी है ग्रे ग्रे तो वर्ड द कलर ऑफ सीओ टू गंदी गंदी सीओ टू इज ग्रे कलर तो सीओ टू इज ग्रे सीओ टू ग्रे एंड साइक्लो प्रोपेन ऑरेंज की वजह प्रोपेन ऑरेंज ऑरेंज सो वर्ड द कलर है इट इज ऑरेंज ऑरेंज सही है फिर आपका एयर और ऑक्सीजन की बात है ऑक्सीजन क्या है ब्लैक बॉडी नीचे ब्लैक ऊपर व्हाइट नीचे ब्लैक ऐसे याद करना अ ब्लैक पर्सन वेयरिंग अ व्हाइट शर्ट नीचे सब काला काला ऊपर व्हाइट ओके एंड नाइट्रस ऑक्साइड इज ब्लू स्काई इज ब्लू इट इज आल्सो ब्लू एंटोनॉक्स इज नाइट्रस ऑक्साइड प्लस ऑक्सीजन 50 तो ये क्या होगा ऊपर व्हाइट और नीचे ब्लू ऊपर व्हाइट शोल्डर नीचे ब्लू सो ब्लू एंड व्हाइट सो ब्लू प्लस व्हाइट एयर क्या है इट इज ग्रे और ब्लैक विद व्हाइट एंड ब्लैक शोल्डर्स खत्म यस तो हु लर्न दिस फर्स्ट आई वाज दैट लकी गर्ल जिसको आशीष सर ने बिठा के पढ़ाया था और ये आया था ठीक है और फिर ये मेरे एग्जाम में आया था और फिर मैं पास भी थी अगस्त 2022 में बहुत ये मुझे बहुत बहुत अटेम्प्ट सारा क्लियर टफेस्ट एग्जाम शायद बिकॉज़ आई वाज वेरी लकी पर्सनल पर्सनल मेंटर अरे 35 है अरे 5 है भी गलती से लिख दिया सही कह रहा हूं 35 15525 बाय मिस्टेक यस चलो ठीक है यस विष्णु करेक्टेड करेक्टेड तो आई गॉट वेरी लकी आई हैड माय पर्सनल मेंटर तब कोविड आ गया था तो सब बच्चे भाग गए थे पर मैं नहीं भागी थी तो सर मेरे साथ थे तो आई वाज एबल टू क्लियर द एग्जाम ठीक है नाउ लेट्स गो टू दिस नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन आइडेंटिफाई द मार्क स्ट्रक्चर एंड द कंडीशन तीन ओके सो आइडेंटिफाई या नाइट्रिक ऑक्साइड अर्जिनाइन सी आता है पर वो बहुत पुराना पी वाई क्यू लाइक दे डोंट आस दैट एनी मोर ना दे आर आस्किंग अबाउट क्लिनिकल क्वेश्चन मोर सो येस दिस इज स्कर्वी तो सर वाइटमिन से दो चीजें होती है बोन में वन इज योर येस दिस इज द लाइन ऑफ फ्रेंकल ठीक है यू कैन अप्रिशिएट द लाइन ऑफ फ्रेंकल योर एक अच्छा कलर लेता था येलो हाँ दिस इज द लाइन ऑफ फ्रैंकल और एपिफाइसल में कैन यू सी द रिंग कैन यू सी दिस रिंग कैल्सिफिकेशन इन द फॉर्म ऑफ अ रिंग ओके सो दैट इज रिंग ऑफ रिंग ऑफ यस वेरी गुड रिंग ऑफ Yeah, wimbing. This one, this happens in your rickets. This is due to vitamin. This is in scurvy. This is due to vitamin C. This one here, and this is due to vitamin D. So, is me kya dikhta hai? You can see, yeah, wimbing. This look at it. Is me kya hota hai? Cupping, the shape, the widening is playing, and what else? The irregularity here the irregularity here that is known as fraying so cupping is a shape the widening is playing widening is playing and the irregularity due to stress that is fraying okay to teen cheeze dikhti hai cupping fraying playing plus you can see bowing of the leg genu valgum ya varus valgum ya varus it is genu Various, very good, very good, very good. So this is seen in your scurvy. Plus berry berry, you know what kind of questions do they ask from vitamin B one? एक तो वो वर्ने के एम्फिसेफिलोपेथी हो गया. That is due to vitamin B, due to chron alcohol, vitamin B one, वर्ने के एम्फिसेफिलोपेथी. And this because alcohol decreases absorption of vitamin B one. Okay. very very you get two kinds one is wet and dry just remember cardiomegaly is in wet what else wernicke is korsakoff syndrome it is memory loss plus psychosis with wernicke's encephalopathy theek hai itna yaad rakh lena and this is another question pyq jo last time aaya tha how do you assess it rbc transketolase theek hai rbc transketolase which is what about this one A seventy-year-old female is presenting with back pain following this X-ray scene. What is the diagnosis? What is the diagnosis? 
सो एस यू कैन सी दिस इज दिस इज कॉड फिश वर्टिब्रा ठीक है इट इज कॉड फिश वर्टिब्रा इट इज किसी को दिख गया था कॉड फिश राइट तो दिस इज सीन इन ऑस्ट्रियोपोरोसिस वट इज द ड्रग ऑफ चॉइस ऑस्ट्रियोपोरोसिस का सर क्या देते हैं क्या दोगे बताओ ऑस्ट्रियोपोरोसिस में फीमेल है डेफिनेटली मैंने पॉजिटिव फीमेल है ये सेवेंटी ईयर ओल्ड तो मैंने पॉजिटिव फीमेल तो शी वॉट इज द मोस्ट कॉमन प्रेजेंटेशन ये और इसको क्या देते हैं बिस फॉस्फोनेट दैट इज द ड्रग ऑफ चॉइस बिस फॉस्फोनेट ठीक है वट अदर एच आर टी भी दे सकते हैं इनकेस बिकॉज ऑफ लैक ऑफ एस्ट्रोजन डेफिनेटली डेफिनेटली वट अबाउट दिस वन दीज आर योर अदर दीज आर योर अदर इमेजेस ऑफ डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ वर्टिब्रे दिस वन हियर कैन यू टेल मी वॉट इज दिस दिस इज योर बैम्बू स्पाइन कैन यू अप्रिशिएट द बैम्बू स्पाइन इट इज सीन इन एंकलाइजिंग स्पॉन्डेलाइटिस ठीक है इट इज सीन इन एंकलाइजिंग स्पॉन्डेलाइटिस एच एल ए बी ट्वेंटी सेवन और क्या कैन यू टेल मी ऑल द क्वेश्चन दैट आर एसोसिएटेड विद एंकलाइजिंग स्पॉन्डेलाइटिस एच एल ए बी ट्वेंटी सेवन सैक्रो इलियाक जॉइंट इन्वॉल्वमेंट एंटीरियर इट हैज अ वेरी स्ट्रॉन्ग एसोसिएशन विद एंटीरियर यूवाइटिस और क्या ठीक है ऑल दीज आर क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू एंकोलाइजिंग स्पॉन्डेलाइटिस यू कॉट फिश वर्टिप्रे इट इज सीन इन ऑस्ट्रोपोरोसिस कैन यू सी दिस वन दिस इज योर पिक्चर फ्रेम वर्टिप्रे इट इज सीन इन इट इज सीन इन वेरी गुड इट इज सीन इन पीजिट्स डिसीज ओके प्लस अनदर क्वेश्चन दैट दे आस्क इन ऑस्ट्रियोपोरोसिस इज अबाउट द डेक्सा स्कैन द इन्वेस्टिगेशन ऑफ चॉइस इज योर डेक्सा स्कैन एंड रिमेंबर इट इज लेस देन फ्रॉम लेस देन टू टू एनी थिंग लेस देन टू पॉइंट फाइव ओके लेस देन टू पॉइंट फाइव इट इज नोन एज ऑन अ डेक्सा स्कैन लेस देन टू पॉइंट फाइव बिकॉज इट इज शोइंग यू बोन डेंसिटी ओके इफ इट इज लेस देन टू पॉइंट फाइव बोन डेंसिटी दैट इज नोन एज ऑस्ट्रियोपोरोसिस नॉर्मल इज एनी थिंग फ्रॉम वन माइनस वन टू माइनस वन टू थ्री ओके एंड ऑस्ट्रोपीनिया इज डिक्रीज इन बोन डेंसिटी ओनली सो दैट इज माइनस वन टू टू पॉइंट फाइव ओके या ओके नाउ लुक एट दिस आइडेंटिफाई दिस प्लिंट अगेन ट्राइंग टू टेक एस मेनी इमेजेस एज पॉसिबल विद द सेशन ओके कैन यू टेल मी वॉट इज दिस दिस इज योर very simple simple it is your tailor pre split what about this one this one this is your von rosen split theek hai aaj yaad kar lo this is your von rosen split okay what about this one this splint can you tell me which splint is this which splint is this this is your this is your milwaukee pre Okay, it is your Milwaukee Prees. Okay, it is used for development. Anjali, we will try to finish in the next. I'll try to finish faster. We will finish faster. Okay, ग्यारह बजे तक कौन कराएगा? Okay, development dysplasia of hip. It is used in development dysphagia of. It is used in development dysphagia of display display. Dysplasia of hip, ठीक है Don't finish it, चलने दो ठीक है ठीक है चलो चलते रहते हैं हम करते रहते हैं Now, see this question. A 64 year old female complains of pain bilateral knee. In the bilateral knee, the pain increases while going up and down the stairs. The X-ray shows bilateral reduced joint pain. What is the diagnosis? Child वाला मिलवॉकी है ये जो दिख रहा है ना आपको खोल दिया है अपना पूरा This is your मिलवॉकी ठीक है ये किसान ने पूरा खोल दिया आओ मिलो मुझे क्या कह रहा आओ मिले पूरा आओ देखो मेरी टांगी भी खोल दी हाथ भी खोल दी आओ मिलो हमसे क्या बोल रहा है मिलो मिलो ठीक है मिलवॉकी ओके ठीक है सर मैं तो वहाँ ने कुछ बच्चे हाँ नो प्रॉब्लम ठीक है चल ओके Definitely, definitely. Yeah. No problem. तुम जाओ या तुम जाओ, please जाओ. What about this one? What about this one? 
this is your okay this is your this is your yeah okay 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 just yeah this is your osteoarthritis what is one minute this is osteoarthritis you can see bilateral pain okay which increases while going up and down this is the clinical feature and there is bilateral reduced joint space this is a clinical feature of osteoarthritis okay this is a clinical feature what about your rheumatoid arthritis ankylosing spondylitis back pain bhi hoga isme rheumatoid arthritis you know wait acha i'm sorry i'm sorry this is actually your von rose rosen splint and this is your milwaukee splint okay i'm sorry galti se idhar side ho gaya okay but this is used for development your von rosen splint is used for development dysplasia theek hai got it this this is your milwaukee this is your milwaukee theek hai aur von rosen is the child jiska khula hua hai sab kuch theek hai just go through this again i'm telling it again ये इधर उधर हो गया ओके इट वॉज मार्क सेपरेटली दिस इज योर मिलवॉकीस दिस इज योर मिलवॉकीस एंड दिस इज योर वॉन रोसन अगेन आई एम टेलिंग ठीक है या मॉर्निंग स्टिफनेस यस रोमोटॉइड आर्थराइटिस वेरी गुड थैंक यू डॉक्टर रेडी थैंक यू थैंक यू नताशा को क्या ये कब से मैं वही बोल रही हूँ आई एम सॉरी नताशा मैं ना बहक जाती हूँ मैं चैट देखना बंद कर देती हूँ तो आई फो गेट टू सी दैट और फिर अचानक मैंने देखा कि कोई बोल रहा है देन आई वेंट अप देन आई सो ओके तो और प्लस आशीष सर के साथ थोड़ी मतलब आप समझ रहे हो ना बात करते करते वैसे ओके एनी वेज लेट्स गो टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन दिस इज ऑस्टियो आथराइटिस लेट्स गो टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन अ थर्टीन ईयर ओल्ड चाइल्ड प्रेजेंस विद ईडी फॉलोइंग outstretch hand and x-ray affected upper limb shows fracture of the upper ulna with dislocation of the radial head to ye bata do kaun sa hai thank you natasha thank you thank you anupreet thank you i love girls you know because bahut achhi achhi pata hai ladka tareef karta hai to uske dil mein kuch hoga karne ke liye ठीक है पर लड़की तारीफ करती है तो दिल से खुशी होती है स्पेशली वेन अ गर्ल टेल्स यू बिकॉज टुडे अ गर्ल टोल मी शी इज आर बैच शी वॉज लाइक मैम आप मुझे लाइक आई एम फिनिशिंग द एग्जाम फिर आप मुझे टिप्स देना टू लूज वेट तो आई वॉज लाइक बाय बिकॉज आई यू हैव लॉस सो मच तो सडनली माई हार्ट बर्स्ट इन टू दिस अमेजिंग ब्राइटनेस लाइक एवरी थिंग वॉज ब्राइट आई वॉज सो हैप्पी आई वॉज सो पॉजिटिव आई वॉज लाइक थैंक यू सो मच जस्ट कीप डूइंग दैट girls should appreciate other girls because it feels very good when girls give you compliments theek hai okay let what is the answer for this this is your montegia fracture theek hai this is your mai bhi sharif hi hu theek hai this is your montegia fracture this is your montegia fracture what is montegia fracture it is ulnar fracture can you see this ulnar this bone has been broken okay this is the ulna and can you see the radial head it has been dislocated so this is your ulna's fracture what about this one this is your montegia fracture this is your montegia fracture yes chintan i have uh, i have labeled it correctly now wait what i will do is i can do it okay i will label it correctly now itself so that nobody else messages me ek minute ruk jao theek hai ho gaya i have labeled it correctly khush 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 yeah so this is your this is your montegia fracture what about this one this is your colles fracture theek hai this is your colles fracture colles fracture it is a 
what it is a fork fork wala deformity right outstretched hand figure jayegi the female falls on the outstretched hand right so this is a fork yeah dinner fork deformity yes dinner fork deformity very good and what about this one which one is this which one is this tell me which one is this modi ji upar kaandi niche acha acha which is this one this is your can you see there is a this is your radius or there is a radial fracture with distal with the dislocation of radio ulnar joint okay dislocation fracture of the radius with dislocation of the distal radio ulnar joint tom peridon it, yeah i did event management also i did modeling also back then uh, like because my mom said that she'll throw me on the street theek hai main 7 saal ki thi meri maa ne mujhe bata diya tha ki sara you have to be itne kabil hona chahiye ki agar main tumhe sadak pe phek dun to tum apne aap ko like you should be able to take your care of yourself so i was like मेरी माँ मुझे सड़क पे फेंक दी थी तो आई वॉज ट्राइंग टू लर्न एवरी वे टू अर्न मनी ठीक है तो आई लर्न हाउ टू डू पार्लर वर्क आई लर्न आई आई नो एवरी थिंग लाइक आई नो हाउ टू पुट हैना आई नो हाउ टू डू कलर बिकॉज माई मॉम हैज अ कॉस्मेटिक्स बिजनेस तो आई वॉज लाइक मैं मम्मी जो भी कर रही है वो भी सीखूंगी आई लर्न हाउ टू कुक आई लर्न हाउ टू वॉश क्लोथ बिकॉज आई वॉज लाइक अगर सड़क पे फेंक दिया तो मैं तो पास भी नहीं हुई मैं ट्वेल्थ पास भी नहीं हूँ तो मुझे काम वाली का काम करना पड़ेगा तो आई लर्न दैट ऑल्सो देन आई आई वॉज टॉल सो आई वॉज एबल टू गेट इन टू मै मॉडलिंग एंड देन इवन मैनेजमेंट बिकॉज आई वेंट टू वॉच आतिफ असलम कॉन्सर्ट इन इट वॉज इन ओमान ओके तो आतिफ असलम हैड कम आई वेंट एज अ वॉल्टियर और फिर मैं घुस गई उसमें तो आई बिकेम एन असिस्टेंट इवेंट मैनेजर तो वो सब इसलिए क्योंकि मुझे डर था दैट माई मॉम विल थ्रो मी ऑन द स्ट्रीट ओके so now this one this question we have discussed the fractures this is your montegia again ulnar fracture ulnar fracture with the dislocation of radial head your dinner fork deformity you can see the dinner fork deformity which is colis fracture and your galizi fracture theek okay? hai which is radial fracture with the dislocation of distal radio ulnar joint okay yeah indian moms man indian moms so a 27 year old male presented with pain and swelling around the wrist there is no history of ye easy hai you can see the soap bubble appearance and it is in the distal radius n so this is nothing but your giant cell tumor okay this is your giant cell tumor or iske bare mein kya pata rehna chahiye remember distal n if the tumor is in the distal end it is a giant cell tumor the age is 20 to 40 years and what is the treatment very 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 important extended curettage with bone grafting okay that is the treatment for this theek hai itna yaad rakh lena giant cell tumor ke bare mein okay okay let's go to the next question again a good pyq asked again and again and again okay <laughs> Natasha, thank you, Reddy. Thank you, Natasha and Reddy. Reddy is from definitely Hyderabad or Andhra Pradesh, I think. Yes, very good. This is Dennis Brown splint. It is used for club foot. It is used for club foot as well as club foot. Yeah, CTEV, right? Very good. Very good. So, आपको तो सब आता है वाई एम आई डिस्कसिंग द इमेजेस वाई एम आई डिस्कसिंग द इमेजेस नाउ लुक एट दिस क्वेश्चन अ ट्वेल्व ईयर ओल्ड चाइल्ड प्रेजेंटेड विद मैक्सिलरी मास विच ऑन फर्दर इन्वेस्टिगेशन शोज द प्रेजेंस ऑफ स्टारी स्काई अपियरेंस इन द बायोपसी ऑल ऑफ द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट्स आर ट्रू एक्सेप्ट वॉट इज आंसर फॉर दिस वन वॉट इज द आंसर फॉर दिस वन ए बी सी डी बताओ ना कौन सा है A B C D. So you have to guess. ठीक है? You have to 
you have to first guess the diagnosis based on the image and now you have to tell jo bhi c bol rahe hai na you have forgotten that they have asked you an accept question theek hai to mere sath kasam khao that you will read the question properly aaj ke baad you tell me sara ma'am i promise i will read the question properly okay so don't forget this ye 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 ek mark le jata hai okay one mark is gone because of this 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 english word so from now onwards we should have 19 plus 1 subject which is english okay we should learn english so that you can rule out rule out what they are asking okay so this is an accept question aise hi examiners has 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 ke aapki le lete hain okay so remember the answer is d you can see even in the question a 12 year old child is given so definitely this is the answer because cmic ka gene mutation hai what is the translocation it is 814 this is a non hodgkin's lymphoma right it is a non hodgkin's lymphoma and it is burkitt's lymphoma all these three are correct so what is not correct not correct it is non hodgkin na hodgkin nahi hai na okay got it so everybody who said c excited in the exam also you look at the question are ye to mujhe aata hai and you will take the mouse and click and go aur fir aap wo accept bhul jaoge don't do that don't get over excited whenever you see a question which you feel like you know 100% read the question properly properly because the examiner might be like <laughs> somewhere okay okay good so i'm trying to teach you how to solve questions also okay now look at this a patient with a history of chronic alcoholism presents with a macrocytic anemia and thrombocytopenia on blood smear numerous oval microcytes and hypersegmented neutrophils were seen shilling's test is normal which of the following is most likely diagnosis okay which of the following is the most likely diagnosis sachi mein wo yahi sochenge how to overcome overconfidence uh yaar i what i can tell you is you have to get 150 marks if you are so overconfident about passing then you don't need to get over that overconfidence because mostly everybody has fear mostly everybody is scared of the exam if you are overconfident that means that means you must have studied तो अच्छी बात है सो दिस इज मिकालोब्लास्टिक अनिमिया कैन यू टेल मी विच वन इज इट बिकॉज ऑफ बी ट्वेल्व या इज इट बिकॉज ऑफ बी नाइन बिकॉज बोथ ऑफ दीज कॉज मिकालोब्लास्टिक अनिमिया सो इज इट बिकॉज ऑफ बी ट्वेल्व और बी नाइन इट इज बिकॉज ऑफ इट इज बिकॉज ऑफ येस वेरी गुड इट इज बिकॉज ऑफ folic acid deficiency why because they also specify that shilling test is normal this was an obsolete test which is not done anymore instead of this now this test is done to check vitamin b12 absorption okay so if it is normal that means vitamin b12 have been getting absorbed so the next best answer is folic acid deficiency ओके क्रॉनिक एल्कोहलिज्म डाला है आपको कंफ्यूज करने के लिए सो दैट यू मार्क अनिमिया ऑफ क्रॉनिक डिसीज यू आल्सो नो राइट दैट अनिमिया ऑफ क्रॉनिक डिसीज प्लस योर आयन डिफिशिएंसी अनिमिया और माइक्रोसाइटिक अनिमिया सो यू कैन रूल दिस आउट ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ दैट आल्सो रीड द क्वेश्चन प्रॉपर्ली आई हैव दिस हैबिट ऑफ रीडिंग द लास्ट लाइन वेरी वेल एंड व्हाट डू आई ऑलवेज टेल यू व्हाट डू आई ऑलवेज टेल यू रीड द लास्ट लाइन If you don't read the last line, most of the time, except is in the last line. So, the, if you don't read the question properly, or you think you get it, then there, that's how you make mistakes. You have to go slow. Give one minute to each question. Why? Because you can make mistakes. You know the answer, but you're marking it wrong because of your, because you're, you're feeling like you know the answer. Okay? Yes. So. Yeah, an anemia of chronic disease. You get microcytic anemia. We have that 
निमोनिक सीता राइट तो लेकिन इन योर इन योर अनिमिया ऑफ क्रॉनिक डिसीज द मोस्ट कॉमन प्रेजेंटेशन इज नॉर्मोक्रोमिक नॉर्मोसाइटिक ठीक है मुझे ये बहुत अच्छे से याद है बिकॉज माई डैड हैज रोमाटॉयड आर्थराइटिस एंड ही हैज अनिमिया एंड रोमाटॉयड आर्थराइटिस लाइक यू कैन सी इट इज अ क्रॉनिक डिसीज एंड ही he always gets in his cbc i always see normocytic normochromic okay to remember it like that mere papa ko yaad rakh lena theek hai and what is the difference between folic acid and vitamin b12 very 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 important methyl malonyl levels they increase they increase in in vitamin b12 deficiency why do they increase because methyl malonyl is converted to succinyl coa by, by the use of vitamin b12 if it is not there definitely it will not convert to kya bad jata hai methyl malonyl bad jayega on pbs what do you see what is the hallmark feature of macrocytic anemia it is hypersegmented neutrophil so your neutrophil is 3 to 5 lobes it has 3 to 5 lobes if we count here One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So there are seven lobes. So this is a hypersegmented neutrophil. Plus, the there will be macro ovalocytes. Okay, macro ovalocytes. All right. My prayers to prayers to your father. He is a very thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, more than five lobes. Very good. Now look at this question. Look at this question. Actually, we are ending this PDF. okay we are ending this pdf i tried to collect as many questions as possible which are relevant for the exam theek hai to we are going to end this pdf now please tell me what is answer for this this is seen this is a picture of kidney you know when i saw this first time mujhe ye ek slice of doesn't it feel like a slice of orange more than a kidney mujhe to ye slice of orange hi dikha and that time i had forgotten all about कॉगलेटिव नेक्रोसिस तो मुझे ये एक ऑरेंज का स्लाइज ही दिखा एंड आई गॉट हंगरी लुकिंग एट इट सो आई वेंट एन आई एट एन ऑरेंज सो दिस इज एक्चुअली अ किडनी एंड रिमेंबर योर सॉलिड ऑर्गन्स अंडर गो कॉगलेटिव नेक्रोसिस राइट दे गो कॉगलेटिव नेक्रोसिस दिस द एरिया द एरिया इज इज दक्चर मेंटेन्ड और नॉट Yes, it is maintained, and that's why, and it goes undergoes coagulative necrosis through infarction. Okay, your heart, your dil, your what is good then? Is it? Uh, I'm not good in Hindi. Okay, so your dil, your kidney. What is kidney for uh, Hindi? Me. Okay, so yeah, brain. In brain, you have liquefactive necrosis. Very, very, very good. In brain, you have. Yeah, yeah. What is good day? What is good day? I forgot. So, Kogli, another appearance that you should remember about that is kid. It is kidney. It is kidney. <laughs> I don't know numbers, and I don't know the ye sab fave day, good day, fafda. Okay, I don't know that. <laughs> ठीक है. Now this this is also an appearance that you can see in your In your cognitive necrosis, ये क्या है? ये क्या है? This is your ghost, to ghost cells. Okay, these are your ghost cells. You can see that the nucleus has disappeared from this. Can you see nucleus here? पर यहाँ से ये भाग गया है. ये बोल रहा है कि मैं आपके साथ रहूँगा. पर बुरा नहीं. Okay? Yeah, yeah. Fafda, Fafda, whatever. Fafda is a dish Gujarat का. Gujarat का ही है ना? See, I'm. I have not lived in India, na. So I'm very bad with this. Somebody, I told something about Ram and Sita, and someone told me, "Ki, ab please mat bolo. Ab Indians ke samne kuch bhi mat bolna, kyunki they will get offended by you." ठीक है. So I, I'm very bad at it. I also, uh, I remember the first question that was asked to me in Philippines was, "Who is our Prime Minister?" And I remember I did not know it. and all the gujaratis got very offended that day they were like ma nahi ma'am kyun bulayenge meri mere seniors the so they were like ye iska passport chino she is not indian theek hai so yeah bahar wale log that's the problem now look at this look at this 
I was born and raised in Oman. I learned Hindi properly in Delhi. Okay, I learned Hindi properly in Delhi. So you can see how successful I am. Okay, I'm a South Indian. Okay, I'm a South Indian. I'm from Hyderabad and Bangalore, and I was born and raised in Oman. So Delhi se koi connection nahi hai. Na main not Indian hu. Right. We spoke Arabic at home. अपनी तारीफ थोड़ी थोड़ी कर लेते हैं टाइम पे ओके सो दिस इज यार यू कैन सी द बार्टोन वॉट आर दीज लाइन्स वॉट आर दीज लाइन्स येस माई डैड इज फ्रॉम बैंगलोर वॉट आर दीज लाइन्स दीज आर बार्टोनियन लाइन्स ओके कैन यू सी एंड दिस इज कॉस्ट इन दिस इज कॉस्ट इन वेरी वेरी गुड वेरी गुड दिस इज कॉस्ट इन लेट पॉइजनिंग ओके यू कैन सी बेस ऑफ फिलिक्स ट्रिपिंग इन दिस बेसोफेलिक स्ट्रिपिंग ऑल राइट ठीक है वॉट इज द ड्रग दैट यू गिव एंटीडोट फॉर लेट पॉइजनिंग एंटीडोट फॉर आर्सनिक एंटीडोट फॉर आयन पॉइजनिंग आई एम वेरी बैड सिंगल मैन वही तो वही तो रह गया वो मुझ में दैट इज माई कमी काश मैं गा सकती मैं गाती रहती गाती रहती गाती रहती Yes, very good. It is बाल Yes. बाल EDTA very good बाल EDTA and your your what what's for iron what's for iron what's desferoxamine very good very good three very important questions ठीक है three very very important questions okay yes lead I remembered it like that lead me D है तो EDTA arsenic बाल ठीक है Now look at this. A patient's serological status is noted to be HBS AG and HBE AG positive. What is the diagnosis? What is the diagnosis? What is the diagnosis? What is the diagnosis? सही केवल सही सही बात कर रहे हो हम करते रहते हैं अपनी तारीफ बाकी दुनिया तो कुछ ना कुछ गलत बोल ही जाती है एफ एस एम इमेज प्लीज विल ट्राई माई बेस्ट अभी दिन बहुत देर आर वेरी लेस्ट इज लेफ ना दैट इज अ प्रॉब्लम यस सो द आंसर इज द आंसर इज द आंसर इज वॉट इज आंसर या इट इज अक्यूट viral hepatitis with infectivity remember your hbs ag what is it it is a surface antigen theek hai it is the surface antigen uh, one nemo, one uh, bal then that is also uh, in telugu there is one word which is very offensive in hindi theek hai okay it is very offensive in hindi then there is one word in tamil which i know which uh, which i didn't find offensive but all tamilians got very offensive theek hai to there are many words in all the languages which are very offensive for other languages <laughs> now surface it is the first first antigen to appear in blood your surface antigen is the first antigen to appear in blood okay first antigen to appear in blood okay to appear in blood this is a pyq which never appears in your blood which never appears in your blood it is your which one is that that is your core antigen core antigen it never appears in the blood and we have antibody we see antibodies in the blood against the core antigen that's why we know ki core antigen hai par dikh nahi raha hai hame just because we do not see it iska matlab ye nahi hai ki hai nahi theek hai so antibodies what antibodies do we have we have igg and igm okay igg and igm these are the antibodies so in acute viral hepatitis which one will be positive hbs 
EG will be positive. In a in an ongoing infection, HBS EG will be positive. What else? Infectivity hai, to HB E AG. That is a marker of infectivity. Okay? This is the antigen for infectivity. Your E is an antigen for infectivity. If there is an antibody against it in the blood, that means there is no infectivity. If infectivity is there, to bone hota. Ye, you know what? The antigen, the antigen against the E is actually in dono ka matlab rishta tha, samman tha, aur ye iska X hai. So, jab ye room mein rehta hai, when he is in the room, this doesn't come. When she is in the room, he doesn't come. Okay? So, and it will pre it is an acute condition. So, IgM will present. Okay? IgM will present. So, this much at least you should know. This much at least you know. Plus, I have a table. I'll just add it to this. Okay? IgM because it is an acute infection. IgG appears in a chronic infection. Plus, it also appears in can you tell where else? Which college? DMSF. Okay. Very, very proud FNG. Actually, uh, when I came to India, na, I uh, realized that we had like one problem that we FMGs face is that many people think ki hame kuch nahi aata. Hame kuch nahi aata, hum kuch nahi kar sakte. So, there were, there were some uh, national medical students who were acting, overacting. Plus, uh, there were other people who used to say ki, inko to kuch nahi aata, ye to bahar pad ke aaye hai. They have studied outside. So, when I came, I realized that nobody will say that to our community. Nobody. Not just me. The whole uh, us NLC. We started because we were like, nobody will do that. Ashish sir has been teaching, even though he's an IMG, he had been teaching FMGs from a very long time. So he has a lot of love for them. We, all of us are FMGs. So he created this with us. Okay. And we are FMGs for FMGs. We try to make our communities very strong. Nobody will abuse us because we are worth it. We can do better. We give an exam. We give an exam. Clear karke pass hote hai. Look at the private college wale log. Do they clear an exam? Paisa phikte and that's it. They have worse knowledge than us. At least we pass an exam and we prove that we are worthy to be called a doctor. Okay? Don't forget that. So, you exam do, achhe se do. Aur ye yaad rakho, you are no less. You are, you deserve it. Thik hai? Ashi sir, Memsi se passed out hai, yaar. He, he is a brilliant genius. He taught FMGs, right? But he created this with FMGs. Alright? Now look at this. What is this question? Which of the following is a stain for? Which of the following is a stain for? Nothing like that. See, there are, you can get married to an IMG. Huh? So there is no hatred. But our community is, we will improve our community. Okay? Apni community se jisko pyaar rehta hai na, wo bohat aage jata hai. Okay. And there is no hate between us. There is no hate between anybody. Okay. What is the answer? Very, very, very good. It is Sudan. So what are your stains? Some stains that you should remember. Amyloid. It is stained by. Are Ashi sir, I am Jiyana. So there are many people. Ashi sir, MC ke graduate. Yaar. So he started it. Can you believe he loves us so much? So there is no hate. There is no hate for anybody. No, no, no. There is no hate. We can all live in a good way. Okay. So your amyloid, the best stain is Congo red. But on bipolarizing light, you can see apple cream by pharynges. The best stain is Congo red for it. Lipids fast. For fats, what do we have? We have Sudan black B. And we have oil red O. Okay? Calcium, we have Vonkosa and Alizarin red. What about Hemocedrin? Can you give me for Hemocedrin? For Hemocedrin? Can you tell me what do we use for Hemocedrin? Very good. So, yeah. Wo bahut bade, matlab, genius hai, yaar. He, you know, uh, 
that's why we like even though i know him for more than 2 years still today still today i am at constant like i'll be like my god this man is a genius every time every time even after 2 years because he'll say something he'll be just sitting and he'll be thinking and he'll say something which is amazing like the way his mind works it's amazing so we keep seeing that and like i at least get over excited even today and i know after 2 3 years also it will be the same maybe for my lifetime maybe till his lifetime <laughs> yes so your mucin is stained by alchin blue now tell me mucin is a part of which thing let's relate it let's relate it mucin is a part of it's going to end of course yaar shivai kaise question puch rahe ho aap post graduate nahi honge ashish sir ha to mucin is a part of goblet cells can you tell me one disease where goblet cells is a hallmark goblet cell is a hallmark of god blood cell is a hallmark of okay very good very good it is a hallmark of parrots esophagus theek hai it is a hallmark of parrots esophagus and what is the change what is a change the what is a metaplacial change here and we will end the session what is a metaplacial change it is it is it changes from it changes from yes there is intestinal metaplasia intestinal metaplasia intestinal metaplasia metaplasia and it the hallmark of this is with goblet cell okay it is with goblet cell and that's it we are done with how many images have we done we are done with so 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 many images and i'm 100% sure this pdf will be very very useful did we do this acha there was this one question lines of blashko can you can you just uh, do this this one question lines of blashko represents what this is a pyq also it came in neat it came in fmg it is a pyq lines of lash remember this represents development lines of development so this are your lines of blashko lines theek hai they they are embryological lines lines that you're born with and what about longer lines what about longer lines these are lines which which you should use use for what whenever there is a cut na there is a cut if you do suturing along this line that scar will hide but if you do against these lines what will happen kya hoga then you will get a hypertrophic scar theek hai to remember these these are the lines theek hai we did everything else and i've i've added as much as i can like whatever i could teach i've added in this you told me images this is a mix bag try to do everything possible theek hai to very very important to go through this pdf yeah i think we have done all we have done medicine also we have done so much this time yeah theek hai plus this slides this one one slides very 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 important theek hai ek baar just go through look at this this is all the slides in one image theek hai to thank you so much for joining in thank you so much for being there let me know i love you too i love you all and i am very very dermatome please what cutie girl you're very cute thank you ma'am for your effort i thank you for joining in thank you for being there because i really really wanted to do whatever i could in this last minute theek hai where i wanted to be there for you if you have any doubts before i end the session please let me know thank you so much for being there i hope this was helpful theek hai these are all the findings in bacillus anthracis theek hai i'm sending the updated now itself how many questions from this how many questions you will tell me theek hai i i'm sure 10 15 questions to aaram se aayenge shayad zyada pdf will be sent now itself and it will be available soon what else what else do you have any queries before i leave what what else 
येस्टडेज इमेज वे डिफरेंट ना एक ही चीज़ बार बार थोड़ी कराऊंगी मैं ऑल द बेस्ट फॉर ऑल द डॉक्टर्स संदीप हैदराबाद एन एल सी आई लव यू गाइज आई लव यू सो मच यू आर द मोस्ट इम्पॉर्टेंट पीपल इन माई लाइफ क्योंकि मैं हैदराबाद से आई हूँ तो यू हैव अ वेरी स्पेशल प्लेस इन माई हैंड ओके एंड बेस्ट ऑफ लक I will try to take another image based session, but I think I've done my max here. Take care, best of luck. Just one bar, bol dena. I will pass. I will pass. I will pass. ठीक है? I will pass. I will pass. I will pass. ठीक है? Salamat. Salamat. Okay. Derma derma images I've added in this. I've added in this. Okay, so let's end this email uh, session. Any queries? Any queries before we end? And please tell your juniors to join NLC. <laughs> okay, love you so much. Proud to be an NLC student. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. We try our best to take care of you, and I hope this session for was useful. Any queries before we end? Any queries? ठीक है. Derma वाली image. मैं I'll add some more. तेलुगु कोंचम 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 ठीक है लव यू तानिया लव यू आई आई रियली लव द बैचेस दैट वी हैड आई विल मिस यू आई विल मिस ऑल ऑफ यू ठीक है पर आई वांट यू टू लीव ठीक है चले जाओ चले जाओ एग्जाम पास करो निकलो पीजी के लिए आना हो वापस ओके ओके चलो लेट्स एंड दिस सेशन हेपेटाइटिस टेबल आई विल ऐड इन दिस हेपेटाइटिस कनाडा आपने मेरा हार्ड वर्क हार्ट से ब्लेस किया है तो थैंक यू सो मच थैंक यू प्रेक्षा थैंक यू ओके लेट्स एंड द सेशन बाय टेक केयर आई लव यू बेस्ट ऑफ लव कीप डूइंग वेल कीप स्टडिंग बस और दो दिन ओके दो दिन फिर गोवा चलेंगे दारू पिएंगे ओके बाय 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 बाय